Oh, hello, gamers. Oh my god! 40 mon Marie's Pop Champ. Wowie! Mango with the 40 months. Mango, welcome back to the conversation. Thank you so much, friend. Oh, welcome back. Mango, thanks for the 40 months. Four decades. Four decades. Holy shit, I'm old. My gamer. Uh, hi, guys. I am comfy gamer today because I'm cold. I'm literally freezing. I had to go get socks. I know it's October, but we live in Texas. It's not fall yet here. Yeah, it's really cold. I think it's just because it was like cold overnight and it didn't warm up. So I'm I'm comfy gamer today. It's 100 in California. It's 83. It's cold in here. Yeah. Our AC hasn't been on. It's probably like 70-ish in here without AC, so it's just cold. I just don't make my own heat, so I gotta I gotta get it from other places. Uh, hold on, the music's still a little loud, and I'm sorry. Um, hello friends, composer Alex, Iggy Pop, Candied Mango with the 40 months, Coda Wardgers here, Astrid Coda, Nubian God, my dear friend. Uh, Nubian God's actually back in the office. Get to say hi to him in person now. Shock and Kelly, hi. Did I miss anyone else? I'm scrolling. I hope not. I don't think so. Coda, did I say to Coda? I think I did. Oh snap! I'm cold if it's in the 60s. It's pretty cold in here. I don't feel cold indoors unless it's under 68. Yeah. It's pretty chilly in here. I'm fine now, um, but I do have hot coffee in my fucking y'all might mug, y'all. <laughs> Best mug ever. You cannot lie to me. Best fucking mug ever. It's weird because it's at a different angle, but I can't. Anyway, best mug ever. Mm. My coffee is very light, very sweet. Ugh. Just like my, uh, my brain. We move in eight days. We move in eight days. Blah. Well, technically. Oh, yeah. Eight days. No, tomorrow. It's cold here, too. Go get Hank. Make him sit on your feet. A breezy 74. Ooh. That's a good inside temperature. It's a good inside temperature. If it's real hot, I think 72. But, you know, 74 is nice. Um, hi, guys. We're here. We're hanging out. Um, he's taking a bath right now. Poor baby. Hank is uh, Hank is our office dog. I call him a shop dog. He's not a shop dog. He lives with someone that works there. He just comes into work all the time. But uh, he was a smelly boy. I felt bad. He also like has like a he's got like a, a spot on his elbow that's missing hair. And I asked his I asked his owner about it. And he was like, yeah, he's been kicking it with his back paw. So there's just like a scab there. <laughs> and I was like, Hank, why? <laughs> Hank also likes to bite me as I walk by. Oh, are you gonna go mess with it? Yeah. Alex's gonna mess with the focus to see if we can have less problems today. Oh, don't worry about it. I'm still here. Focus mode. Uh huh. Um, but yeah, I do need to give Ozzy a bath as well. I brushed him this week, so if I do another brushing, I'm sure I'll get like twice as much hair out and then I gotta actually bathe him. And then I gotta scrub our tub. Y'all, you know what's a what's a travesty? An absolute curse on humanity? All right? It's a fucking textured tub. Why is the bottom of my tub textured? No, it just gets soap and shit caught in it and then it looks awful and it's pain the butt to clean. I did get gloves though. So you don't s slip? Mm -mm. No, I would rather slip and fall than have to clean the bottom of a textured tub. To no fault of your death. Listen, listen, you guys with your OSHA, your regulations, your fear of falling. No! Just buy the little fish stickers like I had. <laughs> uh, rather slip and dead. Yeah, at least I don't have to clean my tub that much. Uh, no, but I we have to clean the tub. I'm very... So we got a new, we got a new scrubby brush. Got some gloves so I can put my hands in the tub and not, normally what I have to do is like stand in like a really wide stance on the outside of the tub and then have my arm on the other side of the tub and then use my other arm to reach in and like scrub. Uh, it sucks, do not recommend. It's like a workout, so we'll see if this is better. I do think too, but I don't wanna. Mordra, come clean our apartment and hang out with Ozzy. He'd love it. Uh, but no, I'm, we gotta clean stuff. We gotta clean, actually I probably might try to well, I don't want to clean the tub before I clean Ozzy. I guess maybe Ozzy gets a bath this weekend. I'll go hang out with Ozzy. Okay, we need someone to watch him while we pack and stuff. So, honestly, not the worst. That's it, though. That's it. Not a thing more. All right, let me go open up my game. So that we can get going. 
Uh, but hi guys. Hope you guys slept well. Um, I actually slept pretty good and then I was a complete and utter potato all day. Literally. Alex was like, do you want to go to Micro Center? And I thought to myself, I feel like I'll die if I leave the house. So we might be going to Micro Center tomorrow. Oh man. But very exciting. Do, 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 do. Micro Center, I know, I know. Are you messing with it again? Uh, What'd you do? I Why you smack my camera? The rod? Waking up early and getting up early are so different. Exactly, exactly. Do not, do not want to go with, but. Uh, because I think what Alex wants to do is he wants to, for our like living room TV, he wants to make like a streaming thing with a Raspberry Pi, like a little streaming computer, which I think is great and would be super useful and would be really nice because we don't have to like deal with Chromecast, yada yada. We just get like a little, a little mouse keyboard and they're on sale right now. So we were like, oh, that's like, that's like a good deal. We should do that. Um, but I literally was sitting here, I'd just eaten lunch, and I was like, I'm gonna die if I leave, so we did not. We did not. I'm very tired of the Chromecast. Well, so actually, our Wi-Fi is buds. Yeah, it like always has problems connecting to the Wi-Fi. Although recently they just did a new version of the Chromecast, it still can't be hardwired in. The Pi has gigabit e ethernet. This is true, we could literally use our gigabit for streaming anime. Are you guys ready for that? You're not ready for how fast we load into new episodes of One Piece. Players in queue, one. It's me, I'm the one in queue. That's me. I'm the one in queue. Oh man. That's really funny that I have to wait though. One malting. Oh no, I'm gonna be on here, I'll just stand here. Oh! Uh, but yeah, we also need to contact a hinty about changing our internet. Probably gonna have to pay for two months because I think our build just happened. Alright, we'll still we'll stay here for a sec. You're right, we're gonna have to pay extra blood. Yeah, I know. I mean, it's it's not a huge deal. At least we'll get a cheaper price. New we will, for like a year, hopefully. You should probably look, actually. You should actually probably look. I did? Oh, okay. That's how I know. Okay. Because that's the thing. That's probably gonna have to be... The 12th also there's just gonna be a lot of things happening and the 13th we're early voting hey you guys registered to vote a lot of places the last day to register to vote is like monday are you registered to vote it's like this week it's coming up vote.gov some places you can't do it online some places you can't i know in texas i don't think you can do it online right now but you should still be registered to vote please thank you Mm, uh, democracy, beautiful, majestic. Um, yeah. E anyway, but uh, I'll be excited. Not that I, actually our our price for gigabit isn't that bad. Um, it's only like a hundred bucks a month, maybe a hundred and like seven. But did it just do a weird thing, or was that my eyeball for my eyelashes sticking together? Did someone say beautiful and majestic? Yes, I'm here now. Hi, Solu, the most beautiful majestic ever. I was here twelve years. Feels old, man. I don't know when I registered. I had to move my registration when we moved to Dallas, but... We would update our address online, Tori. Oh, shit! Okay, cool. We don't have to be... We don't have to be uh, racing against time. Yeah, the day for early voting was the day we were moving, so we're like, we don't want to be liars on our... on our votes. So it's indeed a bald and beautiful. All right, Iggy... Oh, Solu, maybe you can help me. Solu, Iggy redeemed a Torita roast. But I am having a hard time coming up with something in particular to roast Iggy about besides just like his self as a person. But that's not very, very specific. 
Not as beautiful, Majestic as our friend. Oh my god. No backseating? Fine, fine. Uh, I need you guys. So, some one of y'all, someone clipped when Arshafant, uh died. And it was a clip and Dane DM'd me this morning. And I need y'all to see. Oh, what's happening? Hello? Is it falling? Why is it behind? Oh, I've made a grave mistake. I can't even see what it is. Hold on, hold on. Oh, fuck. And Zerus with the resub. All right, I broke it. Tarita nom, Tarita nom, Tarita nom, Tarita nom. thanks for the two two months already. Are you sure, sir? What? There was. I think that was a. Okay, it was a host, but it's not showing up in my activity feed, and I don't like that. It was Fallen. Fallen, are you here? Fallen's in chat. So I'm gonna go with it was Fallen. If not, you can tell me. Zaris, thank you for the two month resub. Welcome back to the conversation. Thanks for being awesome and hanging out with us. All right. So this is what Dane, Dane DM'd me and he said, I open up Twitch and see this. Thanks. Look at the guy. <laughs> Look, <laughs> that's just the most spoilier thing ever. <laughs> I'm really sorry if you're not caught up. Look away. If you're not caught up with where I'm at in the story, look away. But look. <laughs> That's just in my clips now. Uh, my face, I am. Why is he gonna. <laughs> Fallen, you beautiful bean. I'm so happy to see you. I hope you're doing well. You beautiful, beautiful bean. How are you? Do I have to tweet? I do have to tweet. Heck. Anyway, that was my. I woke up and I had this DM from, uh, from Dane. I was like, oh, heck. Ah, oh, heck. Um, he's definitely coming back for Rush Hour 4. Boo! I'm gonna start this house up. I'm gonna my host on the list. I'm here to like mostly need a good distraction. Fawn, I heart you super dearly, friend. Uh, me and Ozzy are sending all of our hugs. Um, and I'm sorry. I hope that we can be distracting or at least a little bit of noise to help drown out whatever the fuck's going on over there. Ah, <sighs> an old meme. Old meme. Guys, have some love at Fallen. Fallen needs a hug or two. All right, I got tweet. Tweeting. Tweeting sucks. Look, if someone comes in and asks why the thumbnail's there, just tell them it's a scene where has too much strawberry jam. Exactly. I was ready for his caloric intake. Have you guys seen that? It's like a picture of like a corgi puppy that ate a thing of strawberry jam and it looks like he's like, his entire tummy is like covered in blood, but he just ate fucking strawberry jam that like fell on the floor. I know y'all know what I'm talking about. I know you do. I type the word worlds wrong so often that my phone does not autocorrect it. Up time. Hey, Chuckles. 20 minutes. Not that long. Um. Title? I don't have a title. I li my, I have no title. What are you doing? Oh, okay. I've been here. Autocorrect is a butt. Not the good kind. Not the voluptuous kind. Just, just the kind. Sorry. Yeah. I mean, it might be the capture card, since it's not a cam link. Yeah, anyway. First time playing? Uh, no. <laughs> no, no, not too close. I'm just here. If it's too close, I get a hot spot. Uh, no, it is my first time playing. I've never, well, I played through this far Final Fantasy. That's it. Not anything else. I know, I know, surprising. Oh my god, your workshop is so loud. Sid. All of you is a hotspot. Bow, 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 
Oh fuck, I need to ho I need to roast. I had to walk across the room to type that. I could just set it. Nah nah, typing it was much more uh much more better. <laughs> For you to chat. Yes! Literally that's the joke. Uh yeah, Chuckles. This is my first time playing, so I am I am Babu, actual sprout. Barely know what's happening. But I mean I know what's happening, but the joke is that I don't know what's happening. Um, so yesterday we did the vault. Hi, Troy. Hello, you. Yuck, yuckin? Hi. Hey, someone to go back to the story for the first time. You could sub to me. That's technically paying me for it. No, I'm just kidding. Uh, no, but yeah, I'm here. We did do the vault yesterday. So we did that dungeon. And then we went back. And I think now we're trying to go to find the archbishop who ran away. I think they're saying they're paying so they can experience again. Oh, that makes sense. Ah. So. Yeah, no, I get that. Never mind. Did I interpret that sentence wrong? Yes. But it was only in text. How am I supposed to know? Uh, how do you wraith? Smoother than my dome. Oh, solo with a self burn. It's a drive by hello. I waved as you drove by. Did you like that? Yeah, it's okay. Can't stay long. I'm sorry, Wreath. Hope you have a good Saturday. Hope you're not too busy. Um, so yeah, yesterday we did the vault dungeon, which was pretty spicy. RB. Okay, actually, if you haven't played Heaven's Word, this is like a, a character dying spoiler, so don't listen for like 10 seconds, but uh, our dear sweet friend, Arshafont, sacrificed himself so that I didn't die, and then he died, and we had to go talk to his dad, and I was like, ah. So, you know, it's great. He sacrificed himself, which is what I wish people would stop doing for us, but like, thank you. Um, I'm stressed. They're gonna get spicier if Iggy and I tank dungeons for you. Oh no. Oh no, yeah, you guys are, you guys do them big dig tanks. God, uh, also hi Freakish, sorry. I need to, I need to, I can't. Uh, like to for you, like your tweet. You can, go like my Twitter, my tweets. I like my tweets. Tell Twitter that you want to interact with me because Twitter, even my tweets that don't have like my link in them are not doing well. Blah. So, you know. The Eric Coil raids? Uh, is that the Alice E story one? Whatever. Uh, we do plan on doing them. Yeah, but right now I'm in the midst of Heaven's Word, so we're doing that. Doing later. Later, Wraith. Have a good night. Take care. Uh, we do plan to do those, though, so I'm pretty excited. Um, but right now we're doing this. Gotta go chase down the Archbishop. Oh, that's a lot happening. There's a lot happening. I need more coffee. Hey, Mazzino! Alrighty! I'm just gonna click on it. We're just gonna go. I don't have anything to talk about. I need to think of a roast for Iggy. Maybe I'll think of it later. I wish I remembered what Iggy's character looked like. Most of the time when I'm playing with Iggy, we're in a dungeon, I'm staring at my hot bars. So, you know. <laughs> Yay, it's my white-haired buddies. Ah, the dastardly duo. What mischief have you two been getting up to lately? You haven't heard, have you? I hardly know where to start. Mm. Yeah, there's a lot that's happened. I'll TLDR it for you. He was a good man. <laughs> Sid, have you ever heard of Aziz La? The Archbishop spoke of it before he fled. Ooh, Sid's gonna know. No, but it's probably some source of phenomenal cosmic power that's key to his plans. From what he told Tori, the Asians tried to tempt him as they tempted Ga Gaius with the ultimate weapon. Even if he spoke true about playing along, I can see him attempting to seize it. Oh! As if we needed another reason to pursue him. Well, I'm convinced. The Enterprise is at your disposal. 
Come to the airship landing when you're ready to depart. Okay. Heh, <laughs> it is just as well. After pulling you out of the fire these last few times, I reckoned I was due to deliver you into it. Heh. <laughs> True. Server? You could just ask me. I'm on Siren. <laughs> Sorry, I'm on Ether and Siren. <laughs> oh. uh, Shotgun Kelly says he thought of a roast for Iggy. All right. I just, life's tough out here for someone with ADHD who wants to be nice to people when I have to think of a roast. Uh, okay, yeah, sorry, it's okay. Normally, for like stuff like that, we don't really have commands because usually I can read chat enough that I see y'all, so I don't mind answering it. It is also up there, but I'm sure that on stream it's kind of tiny for y'all. Kind of tiny. All right, Alfie, talk to me. Oh. Alphanum must see to one last thing before he departs. Into the fire, is it? In that case, I should inform Tartaru of our plans. Pray, go on ahead to the airship landing. I shall join you anon. Anon, you say? My favorite totally word. I'm trying to find people on Primal. Ah, I think that, um... I think that Whiskey, who is another streamer who plays Final Fantasy, and she's a really good friend, I think that she she has a character on Primal. I know that her main character that she plays is here on Ether. Well, she's on she's on Ether, um, but she's on Genova. Jeho Jehovah Genova. Will you click? We fucking click. Thank you. Um, but she has another character on Primal. What's up, Fishton? How are you today? Happy Saturday. Brownies! I should have made brownies this morning. I forgot. We're making brownies tonight, guys. I know. I meant to make them today so I could eat them during stream. I just forgot. I got lazy. Oh, yeah? It was good, huh? Last night, y'all, we went to Whataburger. And Whataburger has green chili burgers again. Is green chili and bacon. Oh, they were so good. And we I only ate half of it, so I had the other half of it for lunch today. I'm jealous. Hi, thanks about you guys. I'm chilling. I'm chilling. I'm doing okay today. Um, I got to sleep in a little bit, got to hang out. I was literally just a bum. I just watched YouTube videos all morning. What is this? A stream? Hi, Kiwi. It's a weekend stream. Nero says share. Of course. You can have some brownies. You just gotta get over here and I'm gonna drop it downstairs to you. Hi, Jelsa Alex. A stream I can watch. Hi, Kiwi. Look at me streaming at EU friendly times. Oh, y'all, at work, someone got a controller that had um, a fucking Deku PlayStation, PlayStation button in it. I don't think this is going to work since we changed it. Yoink. Can you see him? Look at my sweet baby boy. Look how cute he is. It's kind of working. Look how cute he is. You guys can't see this, but that's okay. I know it's dragging my face, but look, look at this face. Look how cute. You can't see it. It's so tiny. Anyway. It's adorable! Because if you don't know, my PlayStation controller has... Oh, it's a lot of dust on it is what it's got. <sighs> Hold on. <laughs> don't turn on the PlayStation. My PlayStation controller has to read a smug as my PlayStation button. Because I work at a custom controller company. And so I had my I had my coworker make to read a smug into a PlayStation button for me. So I have that and I saw another person got some of the orders. They they get custom buttons and someone had a little Deku. So I yoinked it. I It's not like fixed to where it could actually go in a controller right now, but I have it. I also have a fucking Sharingan eye because of course I do. When there are cool ones, I yoink them. But yeah, I also have a couple more Tritus mugs for any, if any of you guys, I don't know. If I'd made more, I would have been like, I'll fix them and I'll send them to people, but... I guess it was like brand new. I don't play on it. <laughs> I don't... <laughs> What's funny is that this this shell is actually Alex's and he played on it a ton. But yeah, I haven't, I haven't really played, I don't know. 
I don't use my controller that much, guys. I just play single player games on it. I do got these though, which are, these are neato. My D-pad is individual buttons. Look at that. Look at that. They're not, uh, they're not connected. Freedus mug, I know. I don't really use my controller though, no. Like there's some, there's some finger gunk. There's some gamer goo. Look at my face, camera. There's a little bit. Uh, but yeah, I forgot that I, I, I yoinked that from like the extra pile at work and I was like, I'm so happy. What are you eating? Ah, hi hungry, I'm Tori. Got him. But yeah, we have Torita Smug in my controller. It makes me happy. I actually almost uh, bought some new thumbsticks from work too, because we have cute ones that are like blue on top. And I was like, ooh, but I don't, I don't know. I don't, I don't use my controller that much. So the fact that it looks cute literally means nothing. <laughs> Oh man. Okay. Sorry for the ADHD. I mean, I'm sorry, but also you're welcome because you guys signed up for this. Well, I say that if you're new here, welcome. If you've returned, you literally signed up for this. I do Iggy's thingy. Oh yeah. Okay. Iggy. Iggy said I could change it to a Torita nice, but if you really want to roast, I just gotta, I gotta like, I gotta do, I gotta like, I gotta figure shit out. All right. Let's see. What is Iggy's profile picture? Is that Mega Man? Spell HG, yes I do. <laughs> You're like, yes, this is good. This is good, I signed up for this content. This is, this is rough, y'all. How do you, uh... Oh my goodness. I'm doing, don't worry, I'm, I'm doing a, doing reconnaissance. Not helpful. When you roasted me, you literally went nice. I know. I'm just not very good at being mean. <laughs> Especially when y'all are like nice to me. Like, I don't know, like people like Brad, who's my friend that I know in real life and I've known for like 10 years. Iggy's a terrible raid partner. He totally doesn't craft food and push people. <gasps> he's never ever, he's never ever crafted me food or potions. Imagine dropping to one HP in a sprout dungeon. Ooh. If you want to roast, just don't try to be mean to be your normal self. All right, here's a roast, Iggy. Uh, I can't. I don't like your flower. Oh, that's just mean. That's not a roast. See, there's a difference. That's just mean. <laughs> I think that there's a difference between being like a mean comment and a roast. I think a roast should be like a playful tug on something about your personality or the way that you do things. Ah, Kiwi's mean, dude. I don't like daytime Kiwi. Or I guess nighttime. It's just like midnight for you instead of 5 a.m. Oh man. I already roasted him for you, Tori. Okay. I got I got the tag team in from Alex. Is a substitute roast. Yeah, I'm gonna need to change that. You said you were oh, you said we were too nice to you. Oh, okay, never mind. I'm sorry, Kiwi. I missed it. I missed it. Thank you. I know listen, I know you don't mean it. It's okay. The flower is eternal. Thank you. Barrel place up. Hi, Barrel. How are you today? Happy Saturday. Should I step on a Lego, then spend five minutes in a room with Iggy? Oh! I wanted to roast you, but I couldn't think of anything worth roasting. But wait, that's actually good. Holy shit, Kelly, my feelings. Get up work early. Yes, yes. Dude, what are you gonna do with your extra time, Barrel? Sit and stare at a wall? That's what I did. Well, I said wall, I stared at my monitor. All right. Um, I have a mild roast. Uh, I appreciate that Iggy does do dungeons with me, but I have a feeling, just a suspicious feeling that he's mostly doing dungeons with me to get the bonus of doing it with someone who's doing it the first time. <sighs> Think about my COVID test on Monday. Oof, I'm sorry, Beryl. It is weird, but from what I've heard, it doesn't actually hurt, uh, but I'm crossing my fingers for you and my toes. I crossed them both. I've been had. Iggy's using small streamers. Wow, imagine using sprout streamers for your own tomes. Wow. All right, Sid, talk to me, buddy. Beryl, I was gonna make a you should study joke, but I don't wanna joke about code right now. <laughs> a Q-tip in your nose. Dude, have you seen how long they are? And they go like, uh, 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 uh. nope, 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 nope. Cause you find it easier than running with a regular duty finder. Bah! Imagine who needs to do roulettes. Just run around some sprouts, dude. 
Okay, uh, the boys have been hard at work preparing for our flight, and I'm pleased to say we are ready to depart. Hi, boys. That is, as soon as a certain... Ah. Alfino! Pray, forgive my lateness. Tatru and I had much to discuss. We still have no news of the missing scions, but she assures me that Uriange and Riola are pursuing promising leads. Ugh, y'all. Uriange. Mmm, sus as fuck. Come, come. We can continue this discussion aboard the Enterprise. You don't have to go that far in your nose anymore? Ah, uh, maybe. The newer tests don't scrape your brain. Well, that's fun. Appreciate not having my brain scraped. I didn't even turn my character. Who are you? You're cute. Hi, Wedge. The others are waiting for you aboard the Enterprise, Tori. Shall we get going? Let's go! Oh, see, this is where we're gonna go to the other side of Cloud Top, which is good because there was an ether current up there and I couldn't get to it and I was pretty sad about it. Why tell me where it's at if I can't actually get over there? That's rude. Oh, yeah. To the northern reaches of the Sea of Clouds, where countless isles yet remained uncharted. In search of a mysterious land known as Azizla, and the unmasked villain who sought to claim its secrets. Hmm. Oblivious to the new threat which followed in their wake. What? They came. I don't like being oblivious to threats. It's just the same game deposit that drove Breath of the Wild, breaking all time. But in Breath of the Wild, you could you could get to all of them, even if you hadn't like been there yet. This one I was like weirdly stuck. Like I couldn't I was over here and I couldn't get up here, but it was trying to tell me to get up here. And like maybe I could have over here. But it was so far away from where I was that I was like, why tell me where that's at if I can't get there yet? Is that a real gamer? I was a real gamer, I was just bored. All right, Alfie. From here, Clamp to Cloud Top looks rather far. Ahem, be on your guard, Tori. The Vanu could be anywhere, even watching us as we speak. Assuming the Soleil is here, I doubt she will come to us. We should begin searching the Isles in earnest. Of course, we must remain vigilant for Vanu scouts as well. I would rather avoid needless bloodshed. All right. Ether current! Hold on, where's Ryuji? Ryuji, get out here, I need protection. Real gamer with food buff? I've never eaten food in this game yet. <laughs> Literally never eaten food in this game yet. Let's see. How close are we? See, this one I have like none of them. I'm assuming this is where I'm at. We are we are not we are not close, y'all. So there's a bunch more to get, which I guess maybe they're just all up here. That would make sense. That bottom part was way smaller. Oh, uh, do, do, do. Alfie! Hi, what's up, Balder? Two person mounts or four. Why is it. What? Oh, I have to slash lookout. Alright, slash lookout. Oh, it's happening! Bashy Bunny! Oh my god! Holy poop. Bashy Bunny! Look out! Hi, Bash Bunny. Thanks for the Twitch Prime sub. Thank you for using your free uh, Twitch gaming sub on me and my little old channel. Thanks, buddy. I appreciate it. Enjoy your emotes. Enjoy your ad-free viewing. Uh, thank you. Thank you. Y'all have some Aussies in chat for Bash Bunny joining the conversation. If you're not already, Bunny, uh, please join the Discord. 
It is a wonderful place where we mostly just, you know, type memes or uh, doggo pics, you know, the usual. Oh, Domestic is here as well. Stand look out at the Isles Eastern. Oh, and I gotta go somewhere else. We're looking everywhere, dude. Don't worry about me. Oh my gosh, jump. Look out. I didn't even know that was one. Oh! Alright, hold on. I need some coffee. Familiar faces. Uh oh. Keep hiding in the shadows. Oh, I just kicked my camera. Sorry. Alfie, you also looking out? Do you not trust my looking? Mayhap this effort was doomed to failure. Beg the mercy of the Netherlands. Does not fight. Does not wish to die. But. What? Was that a Vanu being attacked? But by whom? Let's go find out. Oh my. Over there. Imperial troops? Ish guardian, seize them. They know, they'll know where the archbishop is. Wait, why are imperial troops here helping? The enemy of my enemy. We've no choice. With me, Tori. Protect the Vanu. Oh, okay. Oh yeah, books at the ready. I love being a summoner with Alphano, by the way. I think it is very fun. Oh, I need one of these guys. Who's protecting you? is not out of range. He's right there. Oh, 
Alright, well... We did it. Ozzy would be an awful protector. Ozzy would, if only because he gets so excited to see other people that he doesn't care what's happening. He just wants to go say hi. Mm hmm. Netherlean save Lonuvanu from certain death. Showers Netherlean's with thanks like summer squall. Lo Lonuvanu knows not what wind bears Netherlean's to cloud sea, but warmly welcomes them. Shows gratitude where gratitude is due. Thanks, Lonuvanu. Ooh. Devourer of worlds. Lord Vanu would very much like you to enjoy the hospitality of his village. Oh shit, we're gonna go to his village? Uh, Lonu Vanu owes you much and more, owes much and more to Netherlands as saviors, as heroes. Zoon do welcome you. To village we go, to north, come, come. <laughs> All right. <laughs> well, made some friends, Alphano. So the Galleans were searching for the Archbishop and believed that the Vanu Vanu knew something of his whereabouts. Methods notwithstanding, they may have had the right of it. I conclude that we should accept Lonu Vanu's offer of hospitality and visit his village. Okay. To the village, y'all. The north. The north! Alright. Go north then. Unless it's there. I don't think it's there. Oh, it's right here! Look at that. Oh, get up there. Oh my, look at y'all. Super nope. Do, do. Northeast, which is that way, which is kind of not the way we need to go, but we'll see. We'll see. Unless the victim is allergic to saliva, then I'll see he's a top tier protector. Yeah, if they're allergic to dogs, yo, we got it. Oh, I think it's probably down there. They're allergic to dogs. Ho ho ho. Ozzy will be our savior. Also, hi, PT. Happy Saturday night to you. You gaming today? He's still. Alright, well, we're going right here, so. We'll go do that later. Look at that chunky etherite! It's so short! Like breeze guides leaves like breeze guides leaves to rest. Come and lay down your burdens, Netherlands. Lonuvanu throws wide arms in greeting. Behold, Ok Zundu. Looks very cute. A far warmer welcome than the one you received from the Voodoo, I think. Ha! Voondoo bluster and blow hither and yon. Sound and fury, like aimless gale. Oh. Eh? What unseen lightning begets such thunderous report? What is that? Oh, that's not good. There you are. Did you see it? See what? It's that damned flying whale again. Oh, that's right. I forgot about the whale. The Imperials are after it. Where? The white? Oh yeah, that sounds like him. Oh! God, he's terrifying. Jesus Christ. He's wounded. The Imperials are attacking him. He mad. What are you doing, sir? He just ate an island! Sir? By the twelve, did the beast just eat an island? Oh, insatiable white! Oh, devourer of worlds! Why must you torment us? Bah, Lonuvanu wastes no more words on his unfathomable deeds. Come, Netherlings, come and break words with the chief of Zundu. That's big scary, dude. Yikes, I forgot that that was there. We're gonna have to fight that too. Oh, man. Guys, I got a lot on my Warrior of Light plate right now. I wish it was a little bit Warrior of Lighter. <laughs> okay, sorry. 
Not been too much gaming today. Been more lazy watching other things on YouTube and Netflix. Ooh, that's totally worth it though. I I spent a couple hours just watching YouTube today. It was pretty nice. Just catching up on all the other the stuff I didn't get to watch. Well, that's good, PT. I hope you're relaxing. Well, well, well. What do we have here? Zoom do fix it. Zoom do sell it. Ha. <laughs> It's so bad. <laughs> they are tall. With wisdom deeps as nether and eyes clear as cloudless blue, Sonuvandu speaks for Zundu. Hearken to his words. Okay. Ooh. Netherlings deliver Lonuvanu from claws of steel shod fiends and prove nobility. He knows not to ignore Zephyr winds and brings before you all haste. Soft rains to soothe the heart and sunshine to warm. Gratitude of Sonu, chief of Zundu, is boundless. We are honored to meet you, Chief Sonu. I am Alfino Leveleur, and these are my companions, Tori Tox and Sid Garland. We are, co we are come in search of an airship, a flying vessel of the Nethers, which we believe is somewhere in the cloud area. Oh, cloud sea, sorry. Ah, like two black steel shod contraption from which you save Lonuvanu. Alas, no. That ship belongs to the Garlean Empire, an old enemy of ours, though not the enemy we are looking for at the pre at the present. The men we seek wear armor of purest white and are led by an older man in white robes. Wait, Lonuvanu here tell of these Netherlings. You do, are you certain? As sun rises and falls and returns, we are. Zundu scouts can testify to words of Lonuvanu. Aye, aye. Winds carry purpose of Netherlings to our ears as well. Netherlings seek key to Azizla. Oh, it's a real thing! <laughs> now we're getting somewhere. Tell us, Chief Sonu, what exactly is this Azizla? Beware, Netherlings, for blackest clouds portend greatest danger. Look not into the heart of Tempest. There lies ancient birthplace of sin, home of forbidden secrets. To speak more is to call the wind. But the white devours isle where key is kept. What? He ate the island has the key on it? Fuck, dude. Why'd he pick that one? There were many a tiny island with which he could have, you know, satiated himself, but no! I mean, that one. Fuck. Uh. Deep within bowels of mighty Bismarck, it lies beyond reach of the foolhardy. And beyond ours. Rejoice not in his gluttony. Lonuvanu, as forest stone gives way to water and wind, all yields to the white. The key was tasty. <laughs> this he knows, Chief Sonu. Madness of Voodoo bodes ill for all Vanu. Well, heck, dude. I gotta go beat up another primal. Just so I can go get a key. So I can go stop the Archbishop. So I can save Ishgar. So we can find our friends. Ugh. Alright, it's fine. You skipped all this when I went through it? That makes me sad. I definitely am playing this game more as like a single player game that happens to be taking place in an MMO. But I do know it was pretty common for people to skip the cutscenes, so I'm glad you're enjoying them now. What's on your mug, by the way? Ha 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 ha! Oh, you are not ready for my ultimate weeb. Look at this shit. Fucking y'all might. It's y'all. All might. But Texan. Y'all, it's the best. This is my favorite mug. I literally wash it so that I can drink out of it again. All right, all right, it's so good. It's my favorite mug. It makes me so happy. I realized that like, I haven't drank coffee on stream in a while. So like y'all haven't seen this. Yeah, I don't wait. I have like 50 mugs. I don't have 50 mugs, but I have a lot of mugs. Oh man. Don't you love it when life is not a straight line? How dare it? How dare it? I used to do transcription and made the graveyard was spelling y'all y'all and got yelled at. It's a contraction, y'all. I allow both. 
I, that's not how you all versus y'all, y'all. Um, I, I only, well, can I really though? Because technically, if you follow like how you say can't, it's not couldn't, but that would also just be cunt. So you can't really say that, but I don't know. Both are correct, but one is more correct. You know what? I'll do that. I'll go with that one. Yaldiv, yep. Dude, my favorite thing about being Southern is the fact that Yaldiv is a thing that we say. My education major is showing. <laughs> we take it, we need it. All right. Alphano is familiar, look at his eye, which can mean only one thing. All y'all, all y'all gather around. Alphano's got fucking paragraphs to say. Uh, so, Oz's Law is home to forbidden secrets, accessible only to the bearer of a key which the Archbishop covets. Much as I would like to believe it's safe within the belly of Bismarck, the Knights of the Heaven's Ward wield primal powers. If we do not slay the whale and claim the key first, they surely will. Quite how we will go about it, it quite how we will go about it is another matter. As was it as was the case in our battle with Leviathan, we are out of our element, and this time we have far fewer allies to call upon. Be that as it may, our customary approach still holds true. We must begin by learning more about the White. Let us each question the residents of the village, then regroup and share our findings anon. Y'all is 100% incorrect if it's contracting you all. Yes, because the contraction is supposed to be the room, like where you put the little apostrophe is where you remove like parts of the word or letters, right? So if you're saying you all, it's incorrect. If you're saying ya all, which just sounds like y'all to me. I don't know. Anyway. Okay, let's go talk to some bird people. Ooh, where are they? Oh, literally right there. Hello. Ha ha. If Netherlings seek knowledge of the white, then speak with Kunuval. Kunuvali. That's an I. Foremost keeper of tales. But to neglect not to present self with humility and respect. As sun yields to moon and moon to sun, Netherlands must greet Kuno Valley with a bow. Okay. I gotta go bow so that he likes me. And he helps me out. English hard. Y'all kinda crazy. Wow. Baby Tarkat, have fun! How did I end up up there? Alright. Where is this mystical magical? Zoom do watch. Don't it? Ah, there you are, sir. Hello. Oh, listen to this music, though. Is it? Turn up a little bit. This music's pretty fun. This music's pretty fun, though. All right. Slash bow. Hello, sir. Zephyr winds at your back and sunshine, sunshine to warm your brow, traveler from below. Kunuvali, keeper of tales, hears your words and she remembers. In times long ago, in lands elsewhere, before even the clouds see, the white is one among many. Newborn, he swims beside his many brothers in seas of endless water. Alright, too loud. Uh, but hated the white is, for his brothers are purest black. So great is their contempt, their loathing, that they torn upon, turn upon him and rend his flesh asunder. And so, he fails, he falls, only to rise again. For merciful gods raise him to the heavens, and there he is reborn. Uh, the white still longs for the sea to which he cannot return. But in rebirth, a splinter of the divine is shared. And so he opens his maw from whence come the clouds, and a new sea is born, honed to him alone. Oh. Content, he gazes below, and sees others who are as he, hated and hunted. He weeps, and in his benevolence he raises up isles of earth and guides these people to the cloud sea. Such is the tale of his rebirth, and the salvation of the Vanu may it never be forgot. But this demon which menaces the cloud sea, his rage is that of the Voodoo. His hunger is that of a wild beast. The isles are his gift to us, yet now he must consume them? Kunu Valley knows no tales like this. Oh, all right. Mm. Look 
Look at that cute little etherite, y'all. Look at that etherite. It's so cute. It got like hats. It's shaped like a top. Ugh, I'm a fan. All right. Telling what we know. He's a little flower, just a little, little boop right on top. So, according to the Vanu Vanu, the Sea of Clouds and the Floating Isles were gifts from Bismarck to his people. Gifts which he was taken to eating, yes? Technically within his rights, I suppose, if perhaps a little ungenerous god. Ungenerous. Gods, eh? But what of you, Alpha know? Did you learn not to value? Alas, no. That is, unless you have an interest in the intricacies of Vanu skyfishing. Skyfishing! My gods, that's it! Alfino, my boy, I could kiss you! <laughs> I don't get it. We need some explanation, Sid. From what we have observed, Bismarck is a creature of pure instinct, driven primarily by hunger. When wounded by the Imperials, it fled, but not before devouring another island to restore its strength. What I propose is this. We tow a suitably appetizing island through the Sea of Clouds. In essence, fishing for our flying whale. Once we draw Bismarck out of hiding, we shall use dragon killers to fire grapnels into the beast's hide, and then reel it in close, enabling our resident Icon Slayer to engage it directly. Oh, that's me! I'm an Icon Slayer. A bold plan, Master Garland, but an exceedingly dangerous one. Should Tori fail to subdue the creature, she would almost certainly be eaten, along with the rest of your appetizing island. It'll be fine! It'll be fine! I can get out! Oh, she won't fail, and if anything does go wrong, I'll be at the helm of the Enterprise, ready to tow her out of trouble. I wouldn't entrust a task like this to anyone else. Nor I. I trust you have no objections to my joining you as well. Not at all. The more, the merrier. <laughs> right then. It seems the boys and I have a lot of work to do if the Enterprise is to be ready for our fishing trip. While well, you two need to find me some bait. And not just any island, mind. I want a mouthful at most. Bum, 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 bum. Uh... Chonky youth, right? What's up, Alex Blackmore? How are you? By the one that thinks Icon is a cooler name than Primal? No, I kind of agree. I think that Icons is cool. I think Primal makes sense. And like, I think it was just some, it's pretty iconic. Need you to leave so, no, I'm just kidding. Um, I do think that Icon sounds cool, but the way that they used it was like different regions, like different um cultures call them like Icons versus Primals. So like, I kind of get it. I kind of get it. I get an etherite or an ether current, whatever. Alfino loves it when a plan comes together. Bolt chain an island. <laughs> well, you heard, Sid. We need an island to bait the hook. By way of first step, I propose we speak with Chief Sonu. If the Zundu are as concerned by Bismarck's behavior as they have given us to believe, they may well be supportive of our efforts to slay him. All right. Excuse me. Back up here, I think? Yeah. Man, Alphano, you walk fast. Burp, hey, thanks. The Traumatane is upon us, the White Feast, and the Voodoo rejoice in his carnage. <gasps> you look so cute. Oh my god. No, you. Hi, cat. How are you? You beautiful bean. How is your little your little family? I'm, your boy and your kitty. I'm good. How are you? I'm chilling, cat. I'm having a fun time. Still playing a lot of Final Fantasy. Drinking coffee out of my favorite mug currently. Mm. Boy's very good and little boy is energetic as ever. I know. I know. Is he like noticeably bigger? The cat, not your boyfriend. Is he like noticeably bigger now? Because that's the weirdest thing to me about like puppies and kittens is like how fast they get. Y'all might, listen, have you, hold on. I don't know if you've watched like uh, My Hero Academia, but it's All Might, but instead of All Might, it's Y'all Might. And it's the best, this is my favorite mug. 
I love it. Weaver's got him. He was having food issues, so he's still underway. Oh, poor baby. Poor baby. That's okay. He just needed some love. He's definitely bigger than when we first got him. Okay. Because it's hard for me to tell. Because, like, I saw pictures when you first got him. But I'm not living with him, you know? He's growing up fast. Oh, man. Yeah, he's going to get big. He's going to get big real fast. But that's so great. I can't wait. I'm excited, Cat. He's a precious kitty, and he seems very uh, in inquisitive is the word I think I'm looking for. It's gonna hurt his hair with that hat. <laughs> oh man, Chunky Boo, he's so cute. You guys need to do the little, have you seen where they do ghost photo shoots with like dogs, where they like cut a sheet with holes for their, their eyes and their nose and they do like a ghost photo shoot? You need to do that with your kitty cat. Uh, he sleeps on my pillow next to my face. When he gets big, it's either gonna be really awkward or it's not gonna stop. You're just gonna need a third pillow. You're gonna make him a cotton ball for Halloween? Yes! I think this Halloween, I'm gonna have to actually post all the pictures we took last Halloween. Uh, last Halloween, I made Ozzy a Luffy costume from One Piece. Like, he had like a hat and like a little vest that I kind of haphazardly put together. And I never actually posted them because I just got like super busy. I think October last year was right when I started my job and uh, my grandma was super sick. So I was traveling and then I came back and I started a job. And so I just didn't get a chance to post them. So I'll have to post them this year. Back when Ozzy uh, actually got a haircut. He needs a haircut again, y'all. Don't, don't judge me too much. But yes, expect some Ozzy pictures this Halloween. I'll pretend I don't know that they're from last year. No one would, well, no, y'all would know because Ozzy's hair looks completely different. I still technically have it. Alfredo is still subbed. I told him to stop and he was like, eh. <laughs> Jones, hey, sweet boy Jones. Welcome, we're talking to the Vanu. We discovered that we have to go beat up another primal. So, you know, and that's fun. We're gonna go fishing though. Uh, And the Voodoo rejoicing is carnage. Hear me, Chief Sonu. This creature which torments you now is not the deity who raised up the floating isles and made a gift of them to you. He is a perversion of your beliefs, given form by the Voodoo, a false savior who consumes that which should rightly he should rightly safeguard. Yet it need not be this way, Chief Sonu. We have the power to strike down this imposter, but we must beg you of an island to see it done. Oh. Moats against the Tempest. In vain they do struggle. Yet, who is so new to speak of what may be? Perhaps even the Tramatane can turn to the Ponet. Very well, Netherlings. When you are ready, tell Zundu scouts what manner of island you require, and they will guide you to it. Uh, we shall not fail. Oh, sorry. We shall not fail, Chief Sonu. On that, you have my word. Come, Tori. Let us see how Sid's preparations are progressing. You say my whole Twitch government name, Tori? I did. I'm sorry, Jones. It was funny. It gave me a chuckle. Where the hell is... Where are you? Oh, it's way over there. All right. Mr. Sweetabut Jones. Uh, yeah, I'm sorry, Jones. Every once in a while, I'll just feel like using your whole name. You know, just for fun. To spice it up for flavor. Do, 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 do. Over there. Oh, look at that. East. East, this way? We went to the east, where is it? It's gonna be up, it's gonna be up, isn't it? When Isaac reads Princess Hyrule, Nick is awkward. Northwest. You told me it was to the east, don't lie to me. Oh, it's right here. It was much closer than I thought. Yeah. This song has such whimsy in it. This song is very whimsical. I would agree. Do you ever call him Forgiven? Do you just like look at him in his face and call him Forgiven? Cause like, that's pretty funny. Forgiving, sorry, Forgiven. I'm being very Texan today. Never, it's too weird. I, uh, I drink out of my Y'all Might mug, dudes, and I just forget how to English. I turn into a real Texan. Do, do, do. Let's see. Don't attack me! Northeast. 
Gotta go to work, so try and try to have a good one. Later, domestic! Have a good night, dude. Uh, don't work too hard, I mean, or do. Like, you gotta get that money somehow. Uh, but take care, friend. See you later. Is it up here? Oh my god. North. Northwest? Oh, it's right there! Oh, I see it. Do, do, boop, boop, bop, boop. Will it let me yeet off right here? It, it will not. Come on! Oh, I will! Yes! Hello, sir. Hopefully, it's not too bad. Fingers crossed. I believe! Oh my goodness, the puppers, you getting dinner? I know, you get snacks. I need to go up there. The neighbors behind us? Yeah, they got a dog. And they, the dog just barks all the time. Why? I think the dog is in the kitchen. I think that the dog is in the kitchen. That's the only reason it's that loud. I think, no, I think he's in the kitchen. I think that they probably put his kennel in the kitchen. Yeah, but I'm facing that way. It's fine. Also, they could at any point complain and they didn't, so. Southeast. This way. Right. I'm right. Oh my god, Ozzy. Sir. This is the middle of the. Oh, it's literally right next to Sid. Okay, well, that's handy. Ozzy BB, I know. He, uh, we played with him earlier. He had some treats and we were like chasing him around. And then Alex put his treats inside his toy and then put his toy like wrapped up in a towel. And I've never seen Ozzy so mad. <laughs> he couldn't get, he couldn't get to the toy inside the towel. Cause what's what we'll do is we'll like hide it like under his bed or like under like a blanket or like pillows or something. He doesn't like treats yet, he just won't eat them. Hmm, interesting. Maybe later, maybe later. Uh, but yeah, it's really funny. Cause we try to treat it like a game, so that way it like uses his brain a little bit, not just like feed him, which like granted, if he would not be even harder on his knees, I would just feed him treats all day cause he loves treats so much, but his poor little doggy knees can't handle it, so. Oh man, all right. Talk to Sid. We gotta go. We're gonna go fishing. Maybe. Our Ashgardian friends have furnished us with dragon killers and ammunition, and I've taken the liberty of procuring a magic field generator as well. Rest assured, we've changed to spare. Every link forged by the manufactory's master craftsmen. If you have any lingering doubts as to their strength, know that they were originally intended to bind dragons and were not found wanting. It pleases me to inform the Vanu Vanu have agreed to furnish us with an island of our choosing. Then all that remains is to confirm the readiness of the poor buggers who will actually be doing the fighting. Tori, let Wedge know when your party is assembled. Oh, we need a party? Oh, we need a party. All right, wait, where, where are you? Oh, he's right here. Who likes those wet treats, but they're so messy? I like the tiny soft salmon pieces. Huh, maybe he will. Maybe it's just a weird thing because he's still getting used to like food. He can't smell them. Oh, maybe, maybe, maybe. He's on my desk now, he knows I'm talking smack about him. Can you please give him a little a little head pat and a scritchy scratch for me? Cause I love him and I'm allergic so I cannot pet. <laughs> I, my, between my allergies and me talking that cute voice, my eyes just watered. And I was like, why am I crying about a cat that I can't see? <laughs> Saliva or dander? Um, I think it's both because I used to have like itchy reactions to like dog saliva too. Um, but I think the problem with cats was that they lick themselves. Oh no, yeah. It is like, if I pet them and then touch my face, it's pretty bad. But even like a house that just cats live in, like if I go to a house that has like a bunch of cats, I get sniffly. He doesn't have the undercoat. Ooh, 
Uh, Captain Four, thanks for the coin. I was gonna say 200 Doritos, but those are yours. You traded in Doritos for a coin. I'm glad you like the stream, glad you're having fun. There's nothing you do, yeah, I know. I do love cats though. As long as I don't touch them and then touch my face, it's usually fine. It used to be worse, but now that I'm like an adult, it's, it's less bad. All right, let's talk to Wedge. I probably shouldn't be telling you this, but I don't like this plan. I don't like it one little bit, but I can't help being excited all the same. So tell me, Tori, are you ready to hunt the white whale? Oh, oh, we're going, oh, this is by myself. It's not a, it's not a thingy. Oh, after you then, Tori, all aboard. Oh, never mind, we're good. We're gonna room with domestic cats, I will cry and sneeze, but I can literally shove my face in Boo's coat. Oh, well, how sweet. All right, Alex, are you dragging in here with me or not? You don't have to. That's okay. I can pug it, it'll be fine. I have no qualms. I can help you like, so you wanna come be a tanky boy? How about the cute? This is true, it does make my cute go faster. You're already online, look at you. I love cats, but their hair gets everywhere near my eyes and my face rolls up. Yeah, I think that's the, that's the big part. And kind of hypoallergenic, best kitty. There are quite a few like hypoallergenic kitty cats. Cats are the best. I love cats. I think that if I wasn't allergic, I probably would be someone that would have a cat. The Sphinx. Oh no, not just the naked ones. The poor naked cats, y'all. Plants don't get knocked off. All right, get knocked off. Can do. <laughs> just kidding. Not just the nakies. They're naked. One of our friends had a girlfriend that had a Sphinx cat and he hated that cat. <laughs> he hated it so much. Thank you for tagging along, Solu. How far can Tori fly? As a ragdoll and he's mega fluffy, so much hair. I love this fight actually. We'll see, I'm excited. I had fun with the Leviathan one. Eventually my teammates should harpoon him. Oh. Come in and punch him. Okay. I think it's pulled in close. <gasps> no. Goodbye, Ryuchi. <gasps> I'm sorry. I was looking at my cats for a year before my buddy adapted. Yeah, so some people, depending on um depending on like how bad your allergies are, you can get accustomed to it. To the east. That's a far oh, let's go. Um, but mine is not mine is bad enough that I don't think that I could actually do that. But some people you can't like I think one of my coworkers was allergic to cats, but his girlfriend has a cat and they've been living together for years and he's like, nah, no, nah, I'm fine. Like if the cat sleeps on his pillow, he says it gets a little bad, but for the most part, like living with the cat, he's fine, so. They're just walking into a room with one. Oh goodness. Oh my god, look at that guy. Groundskeeper. You scary. Oh fuck with you. Just the dander though, yeah. I used to, so that's kind of why I give Ozzy shit when he licks me, is because I used to be allergic to like saliva too, even for dogs. I think that that one kind of chilled out as I got older, but uh, I don't want to be in a fate. I just want to go get either currents. 91 yams to the east. All right, we're going to the east. Yams are not very far. I'm out of the hair on my face. So mine won't go away. Cats do not allow in our rooms. Oh no. After all, I was fine. Dog saliva is a healing liquid, dude. That's why I look so young. That's why I tell people, they're like, "Oh yeah, you don't, you don't look that, uh, you don't look very old." And I go, "Oh no, no, it's just gonna let my dog lick my face." To the west, forty-seven yams to the west. Where is it? Is it up? Is it up? Am I, am I underneath it? It's gonna be up, isn't it? I'm, it's gonna be up top, and I'm not gonna be able to get to it. Ugh, it is. It's gonna be up there. Can we see Minerva them running there or so? Does it turn up and down? Yeah. Let's just check. The east. Yeah, it's up there then. All right. Well, let's climb up then. I was going up there and then it stopped. So. Do do. Let me up. Thing over here. Oh, scary shit. Oh, don't attack me. Wait, how? Oh, because those are voodoo's, not voodoo's. They're different. Uh, can I go up here? I cannot. Mm. Oh, I 
can't get up there. Maybe it's not up there. Northeast. Just this uh over here, eh? This music just kind of sounds like music that would be in like an instructional thing in like the 50s where they're like telling you how to like survive a nuclear disaster or something. Nuclear, sorry. What's happening? Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Kitty, 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 puppy, kitty. I love him. Oh my god, he looks so angry. <laughs> Little head pass from you. I love, I love him. He does look, yeah, the lights make him look like he has eye bags. It does look a little eye baggy or like he big grumpy. He big grumpy. Sir, I don't want to fight you, but I'd like to go up your stairs. What's my, no, I'm 64. He'll still attack me. Northwest, north. What's this way? What? Oh, over here? Was I going the wrong way? I swear to God. Where is it? I hate this shit. This is stupid. This is stupid. I can't go- Oh, is it up there? Oh my God. He's chilling on the keyboard. I've seen a bunch of stuff recently where people are- Did... South... South... How am I supposed to go Southwest? There's nothing there. There's nothing- Chat. There's nothing there. I ain't stretching over there. I ain't gonna fight you. Where, where, where? Ah, I found it! Ha <laughs> ha! Joke's on you guys. I found it. Freaking hiding from me. Stupid things. All right, how how we doing? How we doing? <gasps> I got all of them! Now I just need the quest ones. Okay, well, that's a little more difficult. That's a little more difficult. Oh, wait, no, there's one more. Ooh, okay, where's that one? Oh, hi. Hi, Chloe. How are you? 800 yams to the west. Way over there? All right. How are you, Chloe? Hope you're having fun. Please, no. Oh, you guys won't attack me. I'm doing already. Go back to the Airbnb reason. Are we vibing? Ooh, vibing! I do really appreciate going on vacation and then not being out of the house all day. It's nice to kind of just get to like chillax. South. You told me west. All right, fine. Is it gonna be up there? Oh no, where is it? I feel like it might be over there. How do I get over there? <gasps> Look at that giant flower! Oh, it's probably there-ish, right? Or it's there. Hmm. Southwest, southwest, so this way still. We'll go there and we'll look. Final offense about Airbnb forever. It feels awkward to me. So the thing is, especially now, a lot of people literally just buy properties to turn them into Airbnbs. Um, so it's not so much like you're staying in someone's house. Southwest, over there, up. Hmm. Holy fuck, I love cat. Dude, right? Oh my. What a what a joined fate noise. I don't want to be in a fate threat now. Thank you. Cat is not just here. Just boo. Love you, Chloe. Up there, maybe? Maybe up there. How do we get up there? Over there? That's where I came from. Stuff up there. That I think I have to climb the scary stairs. How the fuck do we only have one DPS still? That's insane. All right, well let's go back this way, I guess, and we'll just go. Fight or that guy and go up the stairs, maybe. Excuse me, I got sniffles. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 boo. 
Yeah, it's trying to bring you there. It's a lot faster. Well, so the thing is, I'm trying to waste time anyway, so I don't mind it. It's pathic. What is with that eyes? Oh, they're like, they got like chonkies missing. How are you, pathic? Good evening. Er, no, it's evening. It's 5.46. That's evening. Ah, oh, it happened. Let's go. Someone queued all at once. Yay, let's go. Forger, have a good night. Enjoy your food. Thanks for being awesome, being yourself. I miss you, bye. Ooh. Oh shit. The limitless blue. Oh, look at us. On a fucking floating. This looks like Davy Jones bullshit. Oh, this is funny. Oh. Hey, what's up? You hungry? You hungry, boy? Wardra gifted the sub to Cat before he left. Wardra, thanks for the gift sub to Princess Hyrule. Princess Hyrule, welcome back to the conversation. That was cool as fuck, Wardra. Hey guys, how's it going? Do we? Ooh, cards. Everyone ready? Here it comes. Oh, it's gonna hit us! Ah! Oh. God, how come some of them got hits? Oh, I did get hit. Oh, that's funny. But Happening. Sir, I'm busy. The dragon killers are ready. Ooh, can I go? Can I go stab? Oh, that person stabbed him. Stab him. Oh, oh, pull him close. Pull him close. Pull him close. Pull him close. Reel him in. Reel him in. <gasps> yes. Is it concentration? Yeah, I got. Sometimes I gotta. I gotta focus real hard. I did it again. God damn it. I'm sorry that I'm dumb. Whoa. Oh, hello, sir. Oh, hello. Hi. Hi. How are you? Oh, no, I don't want this. Ow. Sir? Oh, 
damn it, we lost the generator. We lost the generator. Fuck. That's not good. Ah! Oh my gosh, y'all are being scary. How dare you? There's a lot happening right now. Wait, what? What's that? Why is there a base of level over there? Oh, I'm standing in it! Oh my god! Oh, okay. You know what? How was I supposed to know where that was coming from? <laughs> There's probably a way to know, and I'm just a little. Oh, the dragon killers! Do it! Oh, one of them did it! Do that one! Yes! Yes! Gim, 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 gim. It's called Corona. Oh my gosh. I never done that before. Bismarck seizes control of the clouds. No, don't do that. Don't do that. Don't do that. No, 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 no. Oh my god. Oh my god, he has so many. No, sorry. A lot. No, no, I definitely just clicked on him first. I'll go touch it. I'll go touch it. I'll do it. Eh. I did it! Spoopsville. Oh man, look at us. We're so cute. Alright, cool. Leave duty. We did it! Thank you, Solu! I get a crystal again, yes? Oh, it's the key! That's why we were beating him up. I forgot. We needed a key. Ooh, dramatic. Uh-oh. Yeah. Getting my groove back. We haven't heard Midgard Zummer talking shit recently. And I'm wondering, where's he at? Where's he at? Midgard Zummer, what you got to say about it right now, huh? Huh? Oh! Heidelin! Welcome back! Oh, we can only hear part of it. Ooh, ow! Uh oh. Darkness. Light and numb. She's going through a tunnel. We couldn't really hear her. Unfortunate. 
<laughs> Alex is mad because I'm making bad jokes over here. <laughs> oh, I thought it was gone. I was like, oh, no. We got it. Dude, they're going to show up. I have two duties right in a row. Uh-oh. Ow. Oh, fuck. God fucking damn- Fuck damn it, God, I knew it! So falls the Lord of Mists, as did all others before him. <sighs> so falls the Lord of Mists. How many times does this make, warrior of light? Mm -hmm. Ah, how much you have grown. Far beyond the limits of mere mortals. She has what we seek. I'm gonna jump off. Someone will catch me. That she does. The key to Azizla and the secrets of Alag. Oh, it's more Alag stuff too. Oh, heck. No! What the? No! I see you have regained the blessing of light. Ah. Albeit at a fraction of its former strength. Why can you just voodoo magic pick up things, ma'am? God damn it. It's like a Jedi. My thanks to you, Asian. And to you as well, warrior of light, for saving us the effort of slaying Bismarck. I worked hard for that. You guys are being rude about it. Now the key is within our grasp the path to the heavens shall at last be laid bare <sighs> oh he's just gonna open it oh he's just gonna open it oh it's stargate it's not actually final fantasy it's stargate what the i mean i guess it's Alleg technology, which is like super advanced nonsense. What? <laughs> uh. You and your murderous knights, dude. Oh, it was like a, a direction pointing. Uh. By our deeds shall the wrongs of antiquity be righted and man reclaim the reins of history. Well, heck, dude. I worked so hard. Oh. Oh, it is. It is. It is pointing. Oh. Was it hidden in the clouds? Oh, God. They just hid it up there, just hoping that, like, wind didn't just happen to hit it. Oh. Damn. All right. That looks like Destiny 2 bullshit is what it looks like. Holy crap. Ew. Ew. My level is no longer synced. Oh, man. Hi, Ultraviolet. Welcome to Final Fantasy XIV. Thank you. I think I probably almost hit like a hundred times. Play Let me see. What is my playtime, actually? I probably hit a hundred hours by now. Four days and 14 hours. I can't math. 110-ish hours, not bad. Disney in the sky. Hey, Cuban! Solo so famous. Solo's so famous, dude. Imagine being solo. Disney in the sky. Heckin' heck. Gracie's here too, hi Gracie! Um, 
Wow. Cree, thanks for the coin. Glad you're enjoying stream. Okay, I'm gonna finish this quest and I have to go pee really bad. You were just like sit in dungeon queue and you're like, man, I kinda have to go pee. And then like the queue pops, you're like, I still have to go pee. Sky Pia, we're going to Sky Pia. Forgive me, Tori. Had I known what was happening, mayhap I could have done something to stop them. Alas, Wedge and I were still sealed within the engine room and heard not of the struggle until it was over. And now, for all our efforts, the Archbishop holds the very thing we sought to keep from him. But all is not lost, for yet, for we yet live, and we know their destination. Let us give chase and bring an end to their machinations. Alright, I have to go pee. I drank way too much coffee. Well, actually, I drink a normal amount of coffee, but I gotta go pee, so. What do you enjoy the most so far? That's a good question. I actually really, really like all the like story quest stuff. Um, I said this earlier, but I'm, this is an MMO, but I'm treating it much more as just like a single player RPG that happens to be inside of an MMO. Uh, but I like all the characters. I love Alfie now. I love him a lot. Uh, I do like the outfits. Although since I'm leveling a bunch, my outfits change a bunch. It only pops right when you get in there. Works the same if you played as such. Yeah, it's literally the same. And that's the kind of thing that I've been like, I have friends at work who are like, oh, you're playing Final Fantasy. I was like, yes, go play. It just happens to be. Glamour's a big deal to me. I think Glamour is a big like end game thing. I'm just not there yet. She'd like it more if she could wear a hat. I let bunnies wear hats. Listen, bunnies deserve hats, okay? Uh, yeah, I'm gonna go pee. I'll be right back. Don't go anywhere, guys. We're gonna keep playing. Wee, I just have a tiny bladder. Uh, I'm a Viera. No hats for beers, dude. We'd be too strong if they let us wear hats. We'd be too strong. I'm stretching, goodness. Hi, hello, how are you? Eleanor is here. Lower Dungeons Unsync. Realize how much gill it costs for glamour. I'm on week two of Final Fantasy thanks to this chat. Oh, hell yeah, Pywolf. I had a partner for maps. Oh, that's right. I think Solo was explaining maps to me. Kind of, the other day. Uh, hi, I'm back, guys. Small reminder, if you're new here, don't forget to follow me so you guys can find me way easier. 
Da -da 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 -da. Glamour is the end game. How much gill does glamour cost? Am I gonna have to actually go make gill? Am I gonna have to try? Oh no. You get a little lucky on casino rooms. Maps are fabulous. Millions? A lot? No! Alright. Gonna be addicted. You know what? It doesn't cost real money, so I'm more likely to do it. <laughs> the new dad shirt is like three million. There's a dad shirt? Hell yeah. Also, I got chips. Dun, 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 dun. Cause sometimes you just need chips. Um. Oh yeah. Okay. Mm -mm -mm -mm. So many places I had to go. Run the boards and never want for Gil again. You're an Overwatch fan too. Stop playing Overwatch. Come on, double shield, Risa. Ah, yeah. I actually got this sweatshirt at the end of season one of um, Overwatch League. And I was like, oh, I'm going to buy a medium so that way it can be oversized. Not realizing that it is a dude sweater. So, like, it's not just oversized. It is, like, three sizes too big. Did I go any games? We actually did. So, we live in, uh, we live in DFW. And what was it, like a year and a half ago, they had the Texas homestand games and we got to go to them. Ooh, it was so much fun, so much fun. I've never had that much fun in like a room with more than two people, ever. Google showed me your aesthetic, I'm ready. Is that the dad shirt? Oh shit, y'all, look at this. That's, that's my, that's literally my aesthetic. The jean shorts cuffed with a dad shirt. How cute. You're a Dallas fan? Yes, unfortunately. The shirt's $3 million. I love dad glam. <laughs> Look at this guy. You guys can see him. <laughs> oh shit, that is great. That is beautiful. Dad glam. It's from a material drop. Oh, you can do, oh, you need sea cloth for it. Jesus Christ. All right, well. Get to that map when we cross it. Um, you know. Same old, same old. Dallas has fans. Yes, sometimes. I was a shock in New York Celsius fan. Nice, Sue. Nice, Sue. Yeah, we're we're Dallas fans. Mostly, uh, I do... Well, like, Dallas is owned by Envious, which, like, hell yeah, Envious. Um, and I loved Mickey, dudes. I loved Mickey so much. She doesn't play anymore, but it's fine. It's fine. I'm a Dallas fan. Yay. I do have a Dallas Fuel shirt that I got at the Homestand Games. And then I have some uh, Dallas joggers, which are also too big. Why did I order sizes for boys when I am not a boy? I do not have boy body. I have kind of, I have a girl body. Anyway, I would just like to inform you that you, I'm being productive while watching you. Thank you. I'm proud of you, cat. Hell yeah, productivity. Those are just for cat. No one else. Just cat. Big and baggies and mood. If I wear them together, I probably look like scary. Renewed my license? Oh, hell yeah. That's actually good. That's important sometimes. <laughs> sometimes you need that. What does this button do? Oh, I should probably use that, huh? <laughs> I just got this ability and I forget it exists. Sorry. First time in like five years. Oh yeah, mine? I still have like three years on. A wind up Sid. I'm so happy. Perfect. Yes. I need more minions. More minions. I'd be renewed. I think they last for like five to ten years, depending on what state you're in. Seven more. I went to a game only during season two and brought a such a vibe with some joggers. I'm sure you look cool. I just kind of look like I stole someone's sweatshirt. Until I retire. Oh, I see, I see, I see. Well, that's cheating then. Uh, okay. Alphano seems determined to put all thoughts of failure aside and turn his mind to the struggles ahead. Though we failed to secure the key, we must not forget that we succeeded in ridding the realm of another primal and prevented the Vanu Vanu's lands from being consumed in so doing. The Zundu, at least, will be glad of our deeds this day. Let us go and inform Chief Sonu of our victory. Sid and the others will need a moment to tend to the Enterprise, besides. Da -da 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 -da. So you're 65? 
had to give that one up. No. Wait, something is amiss. Oh, voice acted. Yeah, actually, it's a little sus. Why is it so dark? Oh no, what are you guys doing here? Oh no. Imperial troops. And they have already secured the area. Don't see us. We're Reveal not here. yourselves at once. How do you know that I'm here? What's up? And there I was expecting more beast men. Who are you? You don't know who I am. Haha, <laughs> you fool. I uh -oh. thought his guardians responsible for the disappearance of our scouts, but I see now that I was mistaken. Uh oh. Oh, is this the new emperor? I think that's the new emperor. Yeah, it is. Oh, it is. Hello, sir. Just as Wire observed, the warrior of light is wont to appear at the most inopportune times. What's up? The warrior of light? She who bested Van Balesar? It's me, it hello. It would seem that the famous hero of Eosia seeks Aziz Lar as well. Hardly unexpected. The secrets of the Alagan's power to bind icons to their will could scarcely fail to interest the scions of the Seventh Dawn. Yikes, dude. You know as well as we what will ensue should these insatiable creatures be allowed to roam free. That their very existence threatens the life of this star. We but disagree on the solution to the problem. Genocide has ever been the Empire's favored recourse. And that is why we will continue to oppose your every attempt to claim Eorzea. You tell him, Alfie. You do not hesitate to speak your mind. Even when your every word could be your last. Alas, your sentiments betray the narrowness of your view. The fate of Eorzea and its inhabitants is of little concern next to the fate of the world. He's so tall. Look how big he is. Tis my solemn charge as Emperor to bring the icons to heal. If this requires the extermination of certain elements, then so be it. What are you doing? No, 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 no. You don't get to, excuse you. No, don't. They are not his thralls. Are we really not gonna be able to stop them? I feel like we could stop them. Oh! What? Did that guy just get meteor? Where did that come from? I don't know. Take cover! Lucia! Yes! Oh shit! Oh! Yo, she's got her own walker thing? Your radiance. We must withdraw. Hell yeah, dude. Aha! No contacting for you. Is it Sid? Oh, let's see. He just knocked down a box. What is this? Oh. We shall meet again, warrior of light. Oh! On that you have my word. This is the Ishgard airship that I think that Sid was trying to fix? I think that's what it is, probably. Because there's a reason why we went, like, ahead of them. Yeah, it's like the big Ishgardian airship that Sid was working on. Uh... So Garlemald too has designs on Azislaw. But 
Why would the Emperor himself elect to lead the expedition? Yeah, that's a little weird. A little weird. Burr, burr, burr. Hey, actual frog. Big boat is big boat. Very big boat. Very scary. I have to ask, who's your favorite main circus character so far? Um, I mean, I'm a basic bitch. Probably Alphano. He big cute. He he helps us. He's a little dumb. Although I do love Ida. Ida brings me great joy in my heart. She just hasn't been here for a while. She's still missing. Um, yeah. I think Alphano or Ida. They big cute. Thancred's pretty fun. But I haven't spent much time with him either, so. <laughs> Alright. Mm, let's go see. Alfino. Never in my wildest dreams did I think I would stand less than 20 paces from the Emperor of Garlemald. Varys on Galbus in the flesh. Uh, I assume the commander that accompanied him must be the Legatus of whom the Centurion spoke. Ah, forgive me. This is neither the time nor the place for such idle speculation. Pray, return to the Enterprise at once. It occurs to me that our friends may have run afoul of Imperial forces as well. I've yet to appri apprise Chief Sonu of all that has occurred, but once I have, we will rejoin you at the airship. Okay. I'm stressed. Let me go this way. Alright. I'll assume you stuck with Ida. For, like, favorite character, or just, like, hanging out? I do love Alphano, but Alphano is, like, kind of stuck with you, or you're stuck with him, so is that, like, some Stockholm stuff? Who knows? Who knows? Do, 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 do. Oh, don't look at me. Listen, I don't want to fight right now. Wait, oh, I'm going the wrong way. Gotta go up here. Do, 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 do. Hide in the bushes. Hey Sid, how you doing? You guys get attacked or anything? You good? Thank the twelve you're alive, Tori. When that battleship appeared and fired on the village, we feared the game was up for you and Alphano. What in the seven hells happened out there? It was the Empire! First the Archbishop turns up with an Assian in tow, and now the god's damned Emperor pays us a visit. What is this, a procession of notable bastards? <laughs> Who's next, the keeper of the seventh bloody gate? Oh, it's on auto, oops. <clears throat> no one so notable, Master Garland. I am happy to report that the Zundu were overjoyed to learn of Bismarck's demise. Chief Sonu sends his warmest regards, Tori. Uh, there was much talk of westerly winds. Miraculously, none suffered lasting harm during the raid. It would seem the Zundu were taken entirely unawares and wisely chose to offer no resistance. I sense they would have no more fear from the Empire for the present. At least, uh, had the Emperor truly been intent on their extermination, Ok Zundu would already have been leveled. Plainly, Varus is only interested in reaching Azisla. Speaking of which, if you are all ready to continue the chase, the Enterprise is as well, shall we? Yay! Wind up said. Should we? Should I? Should I give up? Wind up Alpha now? He's just so cute. How can I say no to him? Hey, Common Rider. He likes to stalk you. He's just very good at knowing where we're going, all right? I just want Final Fantasy XIV. So I tried playing Final Fantasy XIV like a year ago, and I just didn't really get into it. Um, and they updated ARR so that it was like more, not easier, but it wasn't as crazy. And uh, I didn't have any like other games super duper planned. So Alex was like, hey, you should play it. I was like, yeah, sure, why not? So kind of just worked out. So some luck of the draw. Also, yes, Alex uh, Alex really likes Final Fantasy XIV. So he was like, you should play it. You'd like it. I said, okay. A black Yoshi push. Error was the bane of every new player. 
Streamline if I Yes. Yeah, it was very... I, I, number one, I just liked the story. I know a lot of people didn't really like the story. I can very well see that Heaven's Word's story is much, not like better, but it's like very well done. It is better, but it's much more like well done and like polished and has a little more. The end of um, ARR felt much more purposeful, but you know, what is that, what is that in my inventory? That, oh wait, no. Oh, it's the wind up Sid. Oh, that means that there's something here that I need to use that I never used. Excuse me. Oh, it's just I'm at max. That's why. I need to go uh, sell all those. I can only have 99. Total, 143. <laughs> Figured at the end there's a lot of world burning. Yeah, can I fly yet? No, not in this zone. I'm not done. I have to go do all the... I need one more of the, like, ether currents in the area, and I need a bunch more of the quest ones, so... Judging from Sid's expression, he has news which he believes will please you. Virginia people didn't like Heaven's Word. No, no, no. I'm saying people didn't like ARR. People much more like Heaven's Word. Sorry. I probably just Englished that wrong. Lest you wonder, Wedge was able to calculate the heading indicated by the beam of light emitted by the key. If Ossie's Law lies in that direction, we'll find it. The Soleil may have a lead on us, but she's no Enterprise. We'll catch them. You'll see. Ba -da -ba -ba -ba. I also tried the spicy chicken nuggets. They're pretty tasty. I liked them. They taste like chicken nuggets, but a little spicy. A little spicy. I did not think that I would ever have occasion to pilot a suit of Magitek armor again. Oh. Least of all under these circumstances. Again? Are you a Garlean? Do you have an eye underneath your tiara? <gasps> oh my. She does. She is. I knew it. Oh. She's also Garlean. I knew it. I didn't know it, but look at my that. My full name is Lucia Go Junius. And I was born a citizen of Garlemald. Oh, shit. Ah, that explains it. When we first met in Ishgard, I very nearly called you Livia. Uh, Y'all know Livia. each other? Livia Sasjunius. The tribunus who served under Gaius van Bailsar. Aye, she was my sister. Mm. Though we spent little time together. After our parents were killed in an uprising, we were sent to live in different households, setting us on separate paths. Oh shit. Livia felt at home on the battlefield and chose to become a soldier, while I underwent training to become a spy. Then, Ishgard was... Oh, was she a spy at first? My mission. It was believed that Alagan relics of great worth were stored in the vault. And I was sent to investigate. Hard thanks for the tier one sub. Welcome. Though I was given little information at the time. I now suspect I was searching for the Kiwi, but recently lost. And then I met Sir Emmerich. Oh. It was his usefulness to my mission which prompted me to approach him. <gasps> but I soon oh, found shit. myself drawn to him for other Oh missions. shit. Holy poop, cohort with the tier one sub for himself and then five gifted subs. Oh my gosh. All right, thank you for the five gifted subs. Yo, Gaelic Nord, Johnny D, Pixel, Evo Nub, and Menasaur. Welcome to the conversation. Oh my gosh, y'all. Spam some Aussies in chat, have some love. Thank you, cohort. That is so kind of you. Thanks so much for the support. Yay, welcome new friends. Enjoy your emotes, my dog Ozzy. He's a good, good boy. He says, thank you. Actually, right now he's saying, can I have some chips, mom? Uh, but thank you, Cohort. That's really kind of you. Welcome, welcome, friends. I appreciate that. Wowee. Wowee! Alright. One more chip. Um. Uh, and then let's get going. I had no idea he that she was... was... a prisoner of his past. Judged for his heritage as a bastard son of the Archbishop. 
Yet unlike my sister and I, he did not curse his fate. He simply rose above it. In time, I came to realize that I had found a man worth following, and a new home besides. And when I subsequently confessed all to Sir Emmerich, he was oh. good enough to accept me into his service. Oh. I do not question your loyalty to Sir Emmerich. It is your loyalty to your sister which concerns me. I have long been of the opinion that those who dwell in the past risk losing sight of their future. My sister fought for her convictions and for those she held dear. So do I. So must we all. Wow. Well, I, for one, am happy to welcome a fellow Garlean to our merry band. Mm. Especially one who can make Magitek armor sing. Eh. Chief, we should be getting close. Once we break through those clouds, we'll be right where the light was pointing. Right where Azizla should be. It, all right, we're getting close. Oh, no, Hold I guess on, everyone. Chips. There's no mistaking their handiwork. I guess they didn't know that it was Alec technology, but we did. But only because they told us. Oh god. Oh god. What was that? Some sort of barrier. Oh no. Oh. That looks like the- Oh no. Oh no. She won't hold! She- She's breaking up! I've lost the auxiliary propeller! Sid, it's no use! We must return to Ishgard and find another way! God damn it all! Why do the Alagans always have to make everything so yeah. bloody complicated? Panic! Yeah, let's not crush our ship flying into a wall, mister. Ishgard now. Okay, that makes sense. Sorry. Wow. All right. So, I did pet Ozzy, and then I went digging for chips. I did both. Damn. Okay. That looked a lot like the shield that the knight guy used. So, are they already using Alligan stuff? I don't know. I don't know, dudes. I don't know. Why don't you stop eating chips? Chips are not good for gaming, dude. You know what else is not good for gaming? Dogs barking outside. <laughs> Alright. Them cheddar sour cream? No! They're actually, um, buffaloes. Like, buffalo wings. They're really good. They're like the extra wavy ruffles. But of course, you're saying chips are not good. No, no, chips, delicious, fantastic, wonderful. Chip, chip things on my keyboard. Not good. Go feed my kitty. Feed your kitty, common. You can buy many bags. I bought four bags of chips on Thursday or Friday, and a bunch of other stuff. My viewer is absolutely adorable. Thank you. I pretended to make someone that looked like me. So basically, big ol' eyes, brown hair, brown eyes. That's it. That's all I got. I looked the rest of it, not that much. 
She's perfect. No, you. Just one of those plastic guard things ever couches? Yeah, just like a layer of film. She's you. It. She's me. If I if I shaved off the tails of my eyebrows, which I would not do, because I don't think I can handle that look. She'd look like me. We could be the same. I need to do that thing where I block them out with like a glue stick and some concealer. Okay. All right. So that was fun. Should we call out wind up Sid just for funny? Intensifies. Why are we intensifying? Listen here. General. Minion? No. How do I do this? Aha! Let's get Sid. When faced with a lack of coin to fund projects, Garland Ironworks engineers designed the wind up Sid with hopes that the sale of the automaton would fill their coffers. Indeed, sales have been impressive. The item bringing in just enough gill to pay for the founder's debts. That's really funny. Oh, I see. How oh, funny. Let's see Sid. Oh, look at his cute little hair. Oh my goodness. His cute little hair. Oh my god. Did he have like something in his hands? Oh my goodness. Oh my good. <laughs> look at him. You've won this round. Thank you. Oh my heart. So precious. Uh, Cord, thank you again for the gifted subs and for your own tier one sub. Welcome, welcome, friends. Uh, yeah. <laughs> He's like working on stuff. Oh my gosh. Alpha Nose doesn't do anything that cute. All right, let's talk to Sid. Is that a Torb? It does kind of look like a Torb. It's like a toy version of him, but he's like a minion, so he follows me around. <clears throat> ah, and I, we'd barely finished repairing the damage incurred during our sky fishing trip. On the other hand, any landing you can walk away from, as they, oh, any landing you can walk away from, as they say. I can only presume the Soleil passed through the barrier unscathed. That would certainly explain why the Vanu called it a key. Oh. Yeah, that kind of sucks. We, we kind of need that. Heck. Alphano appears relieved to be staying on solid ground once more. <laughs> Assuming Sid is correct, and I have no reason to think that he is not, the Vanu's key is required to pass through the barrier protecting Aziz La. But even without it, we must find a way to reach the Isle. I shall have everyone convene at the seat of the Lord Commander, that we might discuss how best to proceed. As before, make yourself known to the Guardsman when you arrive, and he will show you in. All right. Oh, bye, Lucia. I have to sneeze, oh no, it's gonna happen. No, it's not happening, we're fine. <laughs> I like watching him run. Okay. Uh, Forgotten Night is where we're going. All right, all right. Bum, 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 ba -na 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 -na. I have a wind up with Chloe. She opens a book and writes notes in it. I think she's building up evidence to get me. <laughs> I don't think I know who Chloe is, so I don't entirely get that joke, but that sounds cute. I just don't remember the Alpha No one doing anything. So I was like, hmm. Although I haven't actually watched him either, so. Ah, you are returned. Sir so Imerk and the others await you within. Thanks. He's talking about the Kardashian. The Kardashians? Hell yeah. There you go. Imagine having a Kardashian in this game. Where's my minion? I mean, he didn't make it in here. All right, then. You know what? Be free. You're fun, but you're clogging up my screen. All right. We're telling him everything that happened. In summary, Ooh. the Isle owes its lofty position to the industry of the Alagans. 
And we can be all but certain that the Archbishop and his cronies are enjoying the view from its top. I see. If we are to join them, we will first need to pass through the Isle's etheric barrier, which is, alas, more powerful than most. Powerful enough to make a mess of a perfectly good airship, at any rate. <laughs> As far as I can gather, the barrier mechanism draws ether from the surrounding environment and polarizes its elemental aspect to produce what is, in effect, a wall of lightning. Mm. It seems plain that without <coughs> Vanu's key, any attempt to reach the Isle will end in failure. Yeah, that's going to be interesting. Alas, the key was careless enough to leave without us, but and I don't think the Vanu keep a spare. Master Garland, based on your experience, is there no other way that we might breach the barrier? Well, in the past, we've beaten similar barriers by nullifying them with elemental converters. We have done that. We have. The one we're up against this time dwarfs all that we've encountered before. The Enterprise simply isn't large enough to bear the requisite amount of crystals. I am reminded of the quantity needed to nullify Leviathan's command of the sea. A veritable mountain of crystals that could only be borne by lashing two galleons together to form a twin vessel, scarcely able to propel itself, much less fly. Yeah, that one was a, that one was a mess too. That said, <coughs> we're not without options. If it isn't feasible to nullify the barrier, we might try piercing it. Oh! How? We create a ram of condensed ether and mount it on my ship. There's just one problem. I don't have the faintest idea how to build one. <laughs> it's going to take a true authority in the field, I reckon. Is that not you? Would that the Archons were still with us. Oh. But yesterday evening, oh. I chanced to find Mistress Tataru in unusually high spirits. Assuming I understood her excited ramblings correctly, she has acquired a clue, pointing to the whereabouts of one such individual. Oh shit! Tatru, you should have called us and let us know! An Archon? Truly? That's the Scions, right? I think ha. it is. Fortune favors the righteous, eh? Well then, let's not waste any time. While you go and look for our missing friend, I'll work on modifying the Enterprise. Her hull will need reinforcing to bear the punishment, not to mention a mount for the ramp. Just you wait, my pretty. By the time I'm finished, you'll be an airship reborn. What are you doing? Why are you dancing, tiny one? Minion of light. All right, then that's helpful. Um, where am I going? Oh, out here. I think? Maybe? Right here. Oh, this is the... Oh. I thought there was a hole in the wall there. Tataru! Hello, my sweet, sweet Tataru. Oh, shit. Oh, he there. Oh, I don't want none of that. Yo, you stay over there, bud. You just sneeze at me? There's a Tonberry. I'm a scared. I'm a scared. Welcome back, Tori. How goes the mission? Did you manage to catch up with the Archbishop and his cronies? Oh my gosh, look, her outfit changed. Wait. Aww. So, you finally arrived at Aziz Law, only to find your way barred by some sort of barrier. Typical. But it's not all bad news. I've made progress in the search for our friends. Don't worry, Tori. We'll get to Aziz Law yet. Yay! <laughs> Tatra is eager to share her progress in the search for the missing science. Ethereal Trail. When you fled to the Victory Feast, you used the ancient watercourse beneath the city, right? Well, shortly after things went back to normal in Uldar, I asked Marshal Terrapin to have the tunnel searched. A logical- oh, sorry. <clears throat> a logical place to look. It was there that you lost contact with Winfilia, Thangred and Ishtola, was it not? 
Dare I ask what the Marshal found? Um, I don't know, actually. Pippin's message just said that there had been a discovery, uh, and that we were to come to the Hall of Flames at our earliest convenience. <laughs> I dare not think what it might be. Uh, we shall depart at once, Tartaru. Uh, let Uriange know to join us in Uldah. He, he will wish to be present as well. Oh, that's right. Sorry. Yes, sir! the voice changed it didn't <laughs> this is my co-worker slash uh, free company mate what are you doing what oh pet you're doing great you're doing great <laughs> oh i'm in the wrong how do i change to free company He's sleeping. <laughs> uh, my goodness. All right. Oh, Sid, don't stand so close to the fire. Oh my God, he's gonna light on fire. All right, so now we go to the Hall of Flames. Go to Ulda, dude. We haven't been back here in a while. Goodness. Whoa. Every time you go into like Ulda or someplace, uh, there's just the all chat is just filled with uh people trying to get you to join their their free company. Next, uh, yeah, this is my next class one. I'll go do that eventually. Ooh, death flare, collars attire. Well, I'll do you later. I'm still a bit over leveled for the current place that I'm at. <gasps> Pippin, Ariange, I'm suspicious of you. If you don't, for, if you don't remember, Ariange was definitely chatting up some Asians at some point. So we are a little suspicious. A little suspicious, Ariange. We are grateful for your assistance, Marshal Tarpin. You saved her grace and father both. Tis the least I can do to repay you. Forgive me my impatience, Marshal, but your missive mentioned a discovery. Yes, of course. Uh, as per your request, I had my men scour the waterways. Almost immediately, we encountered a difficulty. An entire section of the tunnel had collapsed. Uh, with the mineral concerns cooperation, however, we were able to remove the rubble, which yielded the battered bodies of a dozen crystal braves. Oh. <laughs> Go on. Be at ease, Master Alfino. Your friends were not among the deceased. That alone is cause for hope. And, uh, and then there is this. Oh, isn't that Ishtola's wand? Ah, <laughs> Ishtola's wand! I had assumed as much. If I may, Marshal. All right, Ariange. How's he gonna look at it? 
Oh. Tis as I did surmise. Judging by the etheric imprint that lingereth upon this wand, it hath assuredly been employed in the casting of a most uncommon magic. Oh! Namely... Uh, the very first that man did conceive to traverse great distances, and the ancient precursor to all methods of travel that utilize the life stream. Flow. What a mountain poster. The spell entaileth the reduction of the corporal form into its constituent ether, that the caster may enter the life stream and ride its currents thereby. Unlike the teleportation magics of modern times, it requireth not a lengthy incantation. That Ishtola should choose to employ such a spell bespeaketh the need for haste. All of which would suggest she managed to escape. She managed to escape. Would that it were so simple. Know that the scholars of Charlian forbade the use of its spell, and with good reason. Oh, fuck. The caster hath but limited control over his course. For every mage who came safe unto his destination, another would be set adrift in the live stream, never to emerge. Oh. What? No! No, you can't mean. Be not downcast, my friends, for there is yet hope. Uh, tis like that Ishtola's passage had left traces in the live stream. Could we but follow these from the point at which the magic was invoked? Uh, we may yet find her. Uh, to the Sid Sildi excavation sites, then. Our thanks for your aid, Marshal. Do not mention it. I shall pray for Lady Ishtola's safe return. Jaso Lab. Good evening, Jaso. Well, heck. Alright. So, we are now. Company chest? What? Oh. Thank you, Fenner, for having a capital I said, on name. We're going to use nothing. Wait, is Cat's name. Is that an capital I, not an L? I never- are you for reals? Cat, have you been lying to me? For the entire time I've known you? Listen, I put out a bunch of time story. I'm sure you have. I just legitimately did not remember. That's for the free company? Okay, that's what I thought. I just didn't know it was there. The truth is out there. Um, okay, so we're going to excavation site. Where the fuck is that? Oh, okay, good. Also, you can't lie to me. Cat is the real princess of Hyrule. I know no other princess of Hyrule. You cannot lie to me, chat. Tiny Overwatch? Is that a custom game? Tiny Overwatch. Do, 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 boo, boo. Okay, so we... Oh, you know what I can do here? Fly, bitches! Ha <laughs> ha! Joke's on you, nerds. Oh, yeah, this is where we came out. Oh my gosh, hello. Fucking grave robbers. Freaking spriggins. All right. Evidence of Ishtola's passage will have been made faint by time, but mayhap a few scant traces yet remain to guide our steps. Oh, he's using his little glasses. Maybe he's not using his glasses. Oh, he's using his glasses, all right. Okay, let's see.
When he uses that thing, he puts glasses on top of his glasses. Are they literally just hiding up there? There's no way. I guess we're following the traces. We have to go see. The trail leadeth to the north and east. Unto the bosom of the Twelves Wood. Oh. Are you certain? Aye, there's no mistake. Thither hath each Tola journeyed. Thither? And yet the Gridanians have reported no sightings. We must take this to mean she's still adrift. Can we catch her? If it be so, I do fear for our friend. Contrary to its name, the life stream is more akin to a raging torrent. Linger over long in the midst of this maelstrom, and the ether that formeth one's soul shall surely be scattered, ne'er to be reformed. Well, we have to go help Ishtola. We have no time to waste. Orianger, pray explore all possible options for reversing the effects of this forbidden magic. Tori, Tatru, we three shall press on to Gridania and petition the Elder Seedseer's aid. Okay. <clears throat> Oh, they're fighting a big old spriggan over there. Speak with Alphano at blah blah blah's lair. What? Oh, there it is. To New Gridania. Are y'all hydrated? Have you guys had water today? Why you said it's I letter in capital when I C I I C I. Pugline bling, hey pugline, what's going on? You pug pleasing? There's water and beer. Okay, technically yes, but listen. Oh, he just went to the. I gotta go to the. The conjurer's place. Nope, y'all. How dare you not be? How? Dare you not be hydrated on this wonderful Saturday night. Your body needs water. Yeah, so in Twitch's font, the lowercase l and the capital I look the same. So a lot of people, like, if you can't find your name, they'll just switch the capital I and the lowercase l. <clears throat> yes, but actually, no. <laughs> I built a keep last night. I'm still all for it. Ooh, fun, Pugline. You should put a picture in project sharing. I want to see it. I forgot that you ordered all that stuff. I'm sleepy. Good night, good stream. Later, Fishton. It being a diuretic is irrelevant. Listen, sometimes you just gotta gotta pee out all of the water you just put in your body. It's fine. It's fine. It is said that the elementals perceive the life stream. If, as we suspect, Ishtola is still adrift in the midst, they may be able to help find her. But if we are to appeal to them for assistance, we must needs to do so uh, through their chosen, the Padjal. It is imperative, therefore, that we speak with Connisana without delay. Connisana, sorry. I soldered for the first time in my life and it wasn't too bad, actually. I actually like soldering. Soldering's fun. Dude, doing like electrical stuff, like tiny things, is really fun. I do all the etherites. Eh, oh well. I'll survive. I'm never in Gridania. Um, Alfino is eager to petition the Elder Seeds here in return. Why don't we just go? Okay. <laughs> so, Mazino, we were mostly just joking. We're just being funny. It's not that serious. If I'm ever found with a soldering iron in hand, something's gone horribly wrong. I mean, I understand that. That could happen. I was doing your reading. I love it. <laughs> They're not good, but I, I appreciate that you enjoy them. I'm trying, okay? I also just forget what I made them sound like. So every time I like voice off, I know it just sounds different. <laughs> Uh, I've requested- I've already requested an audience with the Elder Seedseer. She will receive us in Lotus Stand presently. We need but speak with the Conjurer Yonder to be admitted. Yes, that is how we go talk to her. That's how we've talked to her every time! Alright. Uh, the Elder Seedseer awaits. Pray, follow me. To the Lotus Stand. To the Lotus Stand. Check out the final name. Hey. Wait, 
I do think I remember Kat posting on Twitter that she actually got her name. It might be crazy though. Tiny Dragonses. Hi, Shashenka. You looking for Tiny Dragonses? I don't have my Tiny Dragon with me today. I have Tiny Sid. Ah, I don't have Tiny. Tiny Sid. Where are you? I guess Tiny Sid isn't permitted in here. Unfortunate. <clears throat> no, Danguses. Oh. Wieners? Danguses? Danguses. A Dangus is a winger? Really? I guess I don't know that one. <laughs> uh, alright. Uh, be welcome, my friends, and speak freely. I gather your suit will admit no delay. It will not, my lady. Pray forgive the abrupt nature of our request, but it is a matter of life and death. We need help! Ishtola might be here, but we don't know where she's at! Help us! Excuse me! I see. As you say, we must needs act swiftly, if we are to free Ishtola from the ungentle pull of the life stream. And as we have surmised, we cannot do this unaided. However... Oh. In requesting oh, the sorry. elemental's assistance to find your stola, you must needs be aware of one difficulty. A difficulty born of the fundamental difference between man and elemental. I'm okay. going. Oh, oops. My bad. That being... In perceiving the world around him, man relies upon senses such as sight and sound. For the sake of convenience, he gives names to such things as are near or dear to him. Being formed of pure ether, however, such concepts are foreign to the elementals. Instead, they perceive by observing the ebb and flow of the energies of life. Mm. So profound a division cannot be bridged with simple discourse. The elementals' voices stir not the air and thus reach not our ears, while our words are but wind to them. Hmm. Though we seers can commune with them through feelings, naught that we can impart will serve to aid them in identifying Yishtola. Nay, they must needs be presented with ether which is akin to hers. If you could but find a family member. <gasps> we have a family member, she's here! Oh, <coughs> I know just the person. <laughs> Literally her family Ishtola member. Ishtola has a sister who came to live in Gridania. She told me about her once. Ah, yes, we know. We know her. Oh, that is most fortunate indeed. Pray, seek this sister out then and bring her to Evershade. There, we shall petition the Great One's aid in finding your lost companion. Every time I see a Lala walk with purpose, y'all. Old Gridania. My queen. Pie Wolf, did you start in Gridania? Is that what you like? Is that what you like, uh, Connie Senna? If memory serves, Ishtola's sister is named Dimitra. Oh, you know her, do you? Well then, that ought to make things easier. Anyway, she spends most of her time around Apkalu Falls, from what I recall. Let's look for her there. All right. Uh, here, maybe? Gridani's best? I started in Gridani before, and I didn't like it. I didn't, but my grand company's- Oh, that's the grand company you joined. Ah, okay. <coughs> Where am I going? This way. <coughs> Been there since beta, and I refuse to leave? I don't blame you. I started in Limza, which was crazy, but I think that Limza was a really interesting place, so. 
I started in Gridania the last time I played, and I just didn't really get all that. I didn't get hooked, so I was like, oh, I'm going to start somewhere else and just see what happens. Which worked out. Greetings, Tori. What brings you here today? I see that you have companions. Lady Amitra, it is an honor to meet you. My name is Alphino Leveleur, and this is Tatru Taru. Oh. Oh, the lights turned on while they bowed. Well, that's cute. So, you are my sister's comrades in the Science of the Seventh Dawn. When I heard that your people were being pursued, I desperately sought to reach Ishtola, but all my efforts were to no avail. Now I know why. A forbidden spell of, spell of all things. That she should be so reckless. Oh, I don't know what she said because I accidentally had auto scroll on. Though we were born of different mothers, our veins course with the same father's blood. I hope that this will be enough for the elementals. Uh, come, let us make for Evershade at once. Trying to install 14 and Screen XP in 1999 account creation? Oh no. Yeah, good luck, Shashanka. There's a lot of, uh, I guess security measures. There's a lot of hoops to jump through, which like is probably a good thing. event tab. Yeah, I know, Eleanor. I shouldn't care that much. It was not pertinent to what we were talking about, so. Basically, we're going there with her, so it wasn't explaining anything. I've done it before. Hello! Oh, Tatru. Your whole outfit's gonna be wet, honey. Let us begin. Ooh, let's go, dude. Raya O, Arun, if you would. Who are these children? Are they also seed seers? Oh. Hearken to me, O oh great ones. Pray, give yourselves to the life stream, a drifting soul to find. Please, Yishtola. Please come back to us. We have to find our friend. Oh. Ooh, sparkles are good. We like sparkles. There. Oh. Now. That kid's got his hair in his eyes. Oh shit. Oh shit. Are we pulling her out of the ether? <gasps> oh! Wait, she's naked. Oh no, don't look. Chat, don't look. Ishtola! Oh, I'm so happy! Don't look at her chat. Shh, look away. Shh, look away. Totally looking. Oh my gosh. Yay! Ishtola Bay. Are you an Ishtola stand, Cuban? Aww. Oh, there you go. Don't worry. He brought a, a blanket. Oh, she brought a blanket. Sorry. <laughs> they wrapped her up like a little burrito. She 
a cat in a blanket burrito. Oh my god. Oh. Oh. My heart. I'm so happy they found her. I'm surprised Tatra isn't crying. <laughs> The room has been readied at the roost. Pray, bear her thither at once. Yeah, I would assume she's probably pretty, like, weak or something, right? Oh. Oh, she's so small. Oh, Tataru. All that remains is to pray, my friends. Thanks for your help, tiny children. Goodness. <clears throat> Excuse me. you guys we're not looking and somebody's like staring gricey went blind uh gricey you should say harken i feel like harken in an australian accent would sound a nice soon they sell the time with a mccurry a mccurrito mug and cookies hi you're super dope no you're super dope how do you play dbd one hold m1 two press space when appropriate uh three learn to look behind you while you run actually that's like the best one is to be able to run while looking behind you so that you can see where the killer is while you're in chase. And then, easy peasy. Looking respectfully, only respectfully. Only respectfully, okay? That's it, that's it. All right. What do you have? What's this? What is your quest, ma'am? Nope. Not an ether current. Oh, I can't. I don't need ether currents here. Duh. Oh, he's Tola. Just seeing her face again. It's. Oh, I've been so worried. <laughs> Talk to Tatru just so she can cry. Oh, my heart. She just needs a shoulder to cry on, guys, okay? <clears throat> Tatru needs you to fetch a few items for a crafting endeavor. Ishtola's resting within an inn room. Though she's still unconscious, uh, the signs are positive. The conjurer says she's in sound health and should awaken before long. Isn't that wonderful? Now, while we wait for Ishtola to wake up, I thought I'd take the opportunity to finish my little surprise for her. Oh, is she going to make her a new outfit too? Because everyone gets new outfits? Yay! It's something I've been working on for a while now, in the hope that she'd one day return to us. Uh, I... Oh, it wants for just a couple more items before it's ready. I've already placed orders for these items. Could I ask you to retrieve them for me? One is in the Leatherworkers Guild and another is in the Conjurer's Guild. Speak with Mr. Sheva and Brother E. Suman Young, and they ought to take care of you. Alright. Conjurer's Guild. There's a... Yeah, okay. Why is it all the way over there? It's in... I have to... Oh, oops. I just dragged my whole ass map. Don't worry about me. Me trying to turn around, drags map. <clears throat> Looking respectfully. Sound? What about sound? Bleh. Safe and sound? She's safe. She's in a burrito. You cannot be any safer than when you're wrapped in a blanket burrito. Okay? All right? There's no better way to be than wrapped in a burrito. I already forgot where I was going. No, I didn't. I'm just going. It's a baggy t-shirt and gray sweatpants? Yes. Or a giant hoodie and uh, leggings. Those work too. Can I just go in here? Do you just like let me in? Oh. I guess I can. Well, I guess if you're not like in a. Like you're not going into an instance or whatever. What the fuck? Let me in. Oh, never mind. I remember where we are now. Okay. Hello. You are come to the Still, Gain Still Glade Fate. Fane, the home of the Conjurer's Guild. How may I assist you? Ah, oh, yes. Oh, fuck. What'd you say? Ah, oh, fuck. Uh, ah, oh, yes. Mr. Tatru's order, as requested, has been sanctified in the right... Oh. It's been sanctified in the sight of the elementals. I know not what she intends for the 
for the staff, but it is a most singular artifact. Even one possessed of my experience would struggle to wield it. Oh, we got her a... Oh, we got her a new wand. Oh, shit. Okay. Neato. Oh, wait. Where am I going? Leatherworkers Guild. Okay. <clears throat> I'm an early, but thanks for the gift sub. You're welcome. Curl Curlins Curlevinsma Curl mm. How do I say that? Charisma Haha -ha. Charisma thanks for the tier one sub Welcome to the conversation Uh thank you for that sub my friend I appreciate it Oh heck you ever just don't have all your thing bobs Where am I going? Heck double heck quadruple heck What is this one? Okay we'll go to the amphitheater Plus one, reading assist for Alex. Mark it down. Charisma. Well, well. Thank you, Charisma. Welcome to the conversation. Enjoy your emotes to my dog, Ozzy. He's a good, good boy. He says, thank you. Uh, but I appreciate that. Thanks for the support, friend. Where am I going? This way. I'm going for a triple double in Tori's chat today. You're just trying to do, do all of it. <laughs> oh, my nose. I'm real tired of like being allergic to the flora and fauna in the place in which I live. Kind of over it, just gotta say. That looks like a subway station. I know it's not, but that's what it looks like. Triple double what? Uh, did right here is worth the gameplay is such a plus. Oh. Dude, that is Ozzy. He's our little doggo. He's a good boy. And he's a cutie. Hello, Leatherworker Guildmaster. Ooh, you look neato. Look at that hair. Wait, your outfit's cool too. What is it? I'm a busy woman, so be quick about it. If you wish to place an order, speak with Randall. Hmm? Here to retrieve an order for Mistress Tartar, you say? You come at a good time. I finished it but moments ago. It was no small coup working working it to her specifications, but I did nonetheless. Payment has already been settled. However, did that girl come by... However, did that girl come by chimerical hide anyway? You need either balls of steel or a bottomless coin purse, and it seemed to me she had neither. <laughs> oh no. She's the meanest person in Gridania? It's because she knows people like it. Alright, I'm gonna go back here because I'm lazy. Mmm, Subway. They have food. Ugh. I'm out of coffee. Not surprising, just sad. <sighs> Tatru's super helpful and well connected. Well, the reason why she's the best scion. She is so helpful. I love Tatru. Tatru is another one of my favorite characters. Can confirm. I love her so, dude. She's such a precious little bean. Sam move out of plan. Oh my god. Hey, Sam. Sam, have you seen this? Speaking of our dog, have you seen this? Sam, how are you today? I hope you're doing great. Oh my god. Trey made that. Trey made that for us, y'all. So cute. Isn't it cute? Trey did a good job. He's very talent. Much, much memory, but a lot of talent. Tadra is the epitome of logistics are important. That's why she was the, with the, what did they call her? The, not the secretary, ah, whatever, she was that. A uh, fantasy story actually incorporate that. I need a Koji Minda one now. Oh yes. I cannot even begin. Oh my gosh, cohort with five more gifted subs. Holy poop, holy poop. No, wow, ah Holy poop. Uh, Bader and Zarya Adel hide, I ID hide, ID hide. Uh, mechanic, holy shinkies, and Willy. Welcome to the conversation. Oh my gosh, cohort. 
Be so nice today. Guys, have some more Aussies in chat for Cohort and those five new gifted subs. Welcome, friends. Wowee! Thank you, Cohort. That's so kind of you. Wait. Where did Tataru go? Oh, she's hiding. I couldn't see her quest item behind this large man. I was like, wait, where'd Tataru go? Oh my goodness. Thank you, Cohort. Holy poop. Holy poop. I know, not even that was high up enough. Enjoy your subs, guys. Enjoy your emotes for the month. Say thanks to Cohort while you're here. Being such a good, nice friend. Thank you, thank you. Ahem. <clears throat> Ah, you're back. You have the items, I hope. I do. Hand over. Oh, it is precisely as I requested. A perfect match for the other pieces, truly. Uh, Jiva is a master among masters. And the staff completes the surprise. Thank you so much, Tori. Tee <laughs> I can't wait to see what Ishtola thinks of the surprise. Lest you wonder, she's doing very well, and the conjurers have left her in her sister's care. Let's go and pay them a visit, shall we? <gasps> Yay, let's go see Ishtola! Oh, Ishtola has a new voice too, huh? I haven't heard hers. <laughs> oh, look at her! Wait, were her eyes Ishtola. always- They were not always like that? Okay, I didn't think so. Is it because she got turned into ether? Maybe that's why. You are safe. Thank the twelve. Yeah, her voice is way less low. <laughs> Something has changed about you, Elfa No. Or mayhap the change is with me. Oh. I seem to sense the ether around me more keenly than before. I mean, you did turn into ether, I'm so... I'm pleased to see you well again. Do you feel strong enough to talk? Worry not. I am well enough. Oh, My heart. Bryce's getting in on the head pats for Tatru. I approve. Tell us then, what befell you after you fled the feast? We were told that there had been a tunnel collapse. That was my doing. <laughs> I brought the tunnel down that you and Minfidia might escape. Oh. At the last moment, I invoked a teleportation magic in hopes of spiriting Thancred away at least. Needless to say, it did not go quite as planned, and I found myself adrift in the life stream. The others? Where are they? Did they not escape? I got no clue, girl. They remain unaccounted for. You were the only one we have been able to find. I am truly sorry. It was the Crystal Braves who pursued you Aww. that day. My hubris that led to our undoing. No apologies are necessary, Alpha No. You are not to blame for what occurred. Know that were our comrades here, they would commend you for keeping the light of hope alive. Don't, don't worry. The others are alive and well. I'm sure of it. Aww. We just need to find them. Indeed, Tataru. Let us find our friends and rebuild the Scions. Ha! There is the Alphano I remember. And I feel much the better for his return. Aww. Tis time I arose. Oh, let us see the new outfit that Tataru made. Let us see it. Oh, she's gonna try to stand up. That's not gonna go well. Is it? Yeah, she has... <gasps> that reminds me. I have a change of clothes Yay! for you. I don't like to boast, but I made them myself. I learned how to weave while we're in Ishgard, you see. I'm so happy that Tataru's making people clothes. Uh oh. What? What? Oh. <laughs> she was like, Alphano, get out. <laughs> I didn't get it. I was like, <laughs> ah, I guess they just make my character leave in case, in case I picked a boy. Oh, that's so funny. I'm laughing. Oh, I'm so happy. 
Oh, oh she looks cool. <gasps> Wait. Oh, shit. Look how cool she looks. Aww. Is your favorite of her outfits? Look how cool she looks. Oh, shit. That's way better than her old one. Oh, shit. Oh, and look at her giant wand. What the, the fuck? Look how big that is. That took place in the aftermath of the assassination plot. It would seem I have been away for some while. Yes, much and more happened during your absence. At present, we seek to follow the Archbishop to Azisla. And you want for some manner of etheric ram to pierce the floating Isle's protective barrier? We do. Might you be able to furnish us with one? We did pick a good person to find first, by the way. A means to prise open a hole in an Alagarn barrier. And one large enough to admit an airship, no less. Hmm. Uh. Nay, I lack the knowledge to devise such a weapon. Wah, wah. Sorry, I didn't mean to punch my mic again. But I know of one who could. Ooh. Ishtola, why are you being mean? A leading figure in the field of etheric research, and one of the finest scholars ever to grace Charlian. Matoya, my former master. Mm. Yeah, she looks super cool. They give everyone the, like, skirt boots combo. I'm kind of into it. Kind of into it. The opportunities are always bomb. Do they get new outfits for, like, every expansion? I would guess so, because that's updating everything. Oh, man, my computer thinking about loading everything in. I can buy that outfit in the Mog Station, too. It looks cool. Oh, it looks cool. All right. Do, 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 do. Oh. Oh. Wow, that took a hot minute. <clears throat> All right. Tee hee, Ishtola looks absolutely smashing in her new outfit, don't you think? She looks great. Yeah, Ishtola, you look cool. I'm a little jelly. You look cool. I like the boots. They switched to a London VA studio for Heavensward. Yeah, that's what Alex told me, is that they actually switched to a, a uh, like, actual British people. Which I think is noticeable, but why is there a... Sp is that someone's pet? Is just a melon? <laughs> oh man, Matoy's an awesome character. I haven't met them yet. Uh, hi, Schneikies. Enjoy your sub. Eat it? I would love to. I eat the melon. Slash eat. Slash eat does not exist. Fine. I'm gonna eat a piece of bread at you. Yeah, come on, melon. This could be you. This is you. Oh. <laughs> Alright. Uh, let's talk to Ishtola. <laughs> Ishola wishes to tell you more about her former master, Matoya. Uh, in my youth, I had the honor of studying under Matoya. In the field of etheric research, she was no rival. Ah! Uh, I have no doubt that her knowledge will be of aid to our cause. The question is, will she share it with us? My master has ever been willful. The gods forbid anyone disagrees with her. When the Galian Empire first marched upon Eosia some 15 years ago, the denizens of Charlian were summoned back to the motherland. However, Matoya refused to join the Exodus. To this day, she lives a hermit's life on the fringes of the abandoned city. So, it is to the Dravanian hinterlands that we must go, to the place of my birth. Oh, your birth? What? That's where you're from? Though Alizé and I were born in Charlian, our days there were short. We remained only until the Exodus, and I have not returned since. Oh, so it be a homecoming, then. As fine a reason as any to go to Charlian, and it would afford us the opportunity to pay my master a visit. Ahem, I believe you've mistaken our primary objective, Ishtola. At any rate, the journey will take us through largely unknown territory. Let us first return to Ishgard and make our preparations. I seem to do for Final Fantasy 16. Yeah, that'll be fun. I'm really excited for Final Fantasy 16. Um, I'm excited that it's like uh, like this 
fantasy, like a what's my, what's my douche, uh high fantasy, like old fantasy, not a future fantasy. I'm excited. It'll be cool. I probably should have finished Final Fantasy 15 at some point, but like, eh, we'll get there. We'll get there, you know? It'll happen. I always idle it in there when I'm online. Oh, really? I played other Final Fantasies. So, um, I technically played like almost halfway through Final Fantasy 15, and I played the Final Fantasy 7 remake that was out, the like first part of it. Obviously, the second part of it is now, or whatever, how many parts they're doing. Um, so those are my only actual Final Fantasy games that I've played, besides this one. Uh, I am a bab. But I've seen, like, obviously I've seen, like, playthroughs or, like, parts of the other ones. Uh, and at some point when I was a kid, I watched my cousin play them, but other than that, I'm very new. I'm constantly trying to get to play the ones. Alex wanted me to play the original Final Fantasy VII, but I don't want to know how it goes. I just want to wait fucking five more years for the rest of the remake. <laughs> Uh, but yes, I probably should play the other ones. It wouldn't be the worst. Oh, man. Another bunny. There are so many bunnies on this server. You like the original seven, but never finished it? So a lot of the ones now, Kohart, you can actually make it a lot easier to play. You can, like, fast forward through battles and also turn off random encounters. That's what a lot of people do. Should play Final Fantasy X-2 for the lols. Five years, how optimistic. Listen, Nero, your girl got a dream. I gotta have something to look forward to besides turning 30, okay? Like, <laughs> you might see 16 for 7R. Oh, I think 100%. Isn't, didn't they say that Final Fantasy 16 is coming out in 2021? Oh, they haven't given a date? Oh, okay. Five years to remake part two. More years for part three. Shh, 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 shh. I only played... 13, ooh. 10 and 10 two are my favorites and I get a lot of shit for that. Eh. Kumiko's being a bunny in chat. Add my reasons why. At least you're not me and got introduced into Final Fantasy with the spin-off games. Oh, there's spin-off games? I don't think I knew that. More info in 2021. I want more info now. After 30 goes downhill. I mean, I'm already on the downhill. How much more downhill can we get? <laughs> I'm just kidding. Wait, after 30, what? I mean, I know the answers to these questions. I am aware. <laughs> uh, after 30, what? Don't you say that. <laughs> Guys, I I get older this month. I'm sad. Am I sad or am I just prepared? Optimistic. Yeah, my birthday's like really soon. Isn't that scary? Like three. Almost three. 17 days till my birthdays. Yikes. My mom asked me today what I wanted for my birthday and I went, I don't know. <laughs> yeah. She's like, I can send you guys dinner. And I was like, oh, I'll see. We're like moving, so. Lift with your legs, not your back. This is true. Who's crazy good with time management? Ooh, that's good to know. I'm asking you guys like PC parts. Yeah. I guess. What do, what do I need? The thing that I need is like I need a processor and a motherboard. I don't know, dudes. Alex's parents got me uh, the drawers that are going to hold up my desk. Hey! Going downhill is easier than uphill. Ooh! Very true, Gricey. Mentally prepared. Another Libra. Wow! Listen here, I'll fight you, but I won't because I'm very indecisive about it. May as well embrace it. I mean, I don't actually care. Um, I, I don't have any qualms with getting older. Uh, for the most part, I like myself as a person as I get older more and more, so I'm pretty pretty happy with that. A new BIOS battery? I'm old. No, no, no. You're all young. You're all on the internet, which means you can't be any... any. Uh, you still play video games and you're hanging on the internet. That means you can't be any older than, like, 19. Once you turn 20 and become a real adult, you don't get to play video games anymore. All right, Alfie. Shalian is situated in the Dravanian hinterlands. To get there, we must strike west and traverse the breadth of the Dravanian forelands. Make no mistake, it'll be a grueling journey. And the party shall be comprised of Tori, Ishtola, and myself. Tatru, pray remain in Ishgard and continue the search for our missing friends. Yes, sir! First, let us make for Tailfeather. Okay. Hi, Ishtola. 
There's a grandma streamer. Like the grandma, uh, the grandma Skyrim player. Love her. Fallout 4 gaming. You're cute. I can't make the my cute what joke because you technically have an apostrophe, but you missed the E at the end. Hmm. Oh, guys, I'm actually like, here's the thing. When we get old, we're going to have so much to do because we're still going to be able to play video games. Old people now don't play video games. They're missing out on so much, dude. I'm also cute. Gricey is very cute. Can't confirm. Are you a... Your skin is... Oh! Ah, the yokai stuff. <laughs> I need the yokai book. I need to go do the stuff so that I can get the summoner's yokai book. It's literally a cat book. It's what I need in my life, okay? Ishtola! Ishtola. I don't think you say the E, but I go, Ishtola. Ish, it's Ishtola, Ishtola. Uh, a long soak in the live stream followed by a long journey. I would not recommend it to anyone. But rest assured, my strength is returning to me. I shall be back to my former self ere long. I'm glad Ishtola, I missed you. Like, look at our ride is. Here's the thing though. There's some very accessible, uh, like controllers being made now. That make it a lot easier for people who like don't have like super dexterous hands. Also, it's all gonna be in VR, dude. You're gonna be able to play games with your mind. Who needs hands? Just use your brain. Ooh, katanas. Yes. Uh, he shows ready to press on westward to the Dravenian hinterlands. I believe I am sufficiently rested. Let us continue west to Charlian. Once we descend the mountain path, we arrive at the Dravanian hinterlands. From there, it is but a short distance to the city. Be warned that we shall pa be passing through Nath territory. We must needs be wary of them and the dragons both. The PSP 9 will be done with vapor balls. Oh, also, hi, Kumiko. We have a guy and his wife in our pre company that are in their early 70s. See, dude? Gamers. Gamers everywhere. Where am I going? Oh, I need to go that way. What? Oh, it's weird. Let's go back over. Why did we come here then? What? Why did we come here if we're going over here? Why don't we go here? Squeeze me? I was about to quote that ad. Use your brain at 80. Gaming starting to it. I should pre-order a Vapor Ball now. Ooh, if you pre-order it now, it might actually be ready by the time that you're old. So... Yeah, that's the way we're going. Okay, interesting. Seems weird. Whatever. Hi, dragons. Please don't get mad at me. I know I went and definitely murdered one of your, like, big old friends, but, uh, don't hold it against me, please. Star Citizen might be in beta. <laughs> I do not know what Star Citizen is, so I don't think I get that joke. I'm sorry. Well, here's the thing. I got what the joke was supposed to be, but I don't know what Star Citizen is. Uh-huh. Oh, no. A very expensive vanity project. Yikes. It's the biggest crown fund in history, and it's not, like, actually happening. Yikes. Uh, it's been more than 10 years. A game that cost $12,000 to play. Scam Citizen. For their kids rather than actual money. Hmm. Yeah, I actually haven't heard of that. I mean, I guess I've heard the term Star Citizen. Like, I've heard the, the name. River, but, ooh. Where to the melted snows of Abelathia's spine eventually find their way by means of a thousand silver streams. Whose waters have long nourished the Travanian hinterland. 
and so provided for a oh. settlement of learned souls from across the northern sea. This does look a lot like a college campus. To the city of Charlian, that great seat of knowledge now abandoned by her keepers, they came. All right. Uh, Matoya dwells on the far side of the Tha Thaliac River. Let us search for a crossing. Ooh, listen to this music. Ooh. I'm into that. Hey, Orzia College. What you're seeing is what happens when a project manager doesn't have anything telling him no. Are you talking about Star Citizen? Okay. Ooh, are there any ether currents over here? 80 yelms to the west. Haha, there is. They have limitless funding and nobody answers to, which is a terrible thing for creatives. Because they're just going to keep adding things. They're just going to be excited and keep adding things. Ugh, that's rough. Yeah, limitations aren't necessarily a bad thing in, like, creative endeavors. Mmm, sriracha. I bought spicy noobles last night. I even have leftover prime crackers. What's a spicy noobles? I don't want to touch you. But sorry. My bad. A wildebeest? Down there? Still northwest. Okay. But. Noobble equals noodle. Okay, that's what I thought. But I just wanted to make sure. Wasn't trying to. You know, I think it might be up there. I don't think I can get to it, actually. That sucks. What are those? South. Yeah, it's in here. All right, I'm not going in there yet. Or am I? Hold on. I have Ozzy hair on my face. Goblins live here. Oh, it must be on top, but I don't think I can get on top yet. The Maker's Quarter. Oh, look at this. There will be goblins. Say two yams to the north. Oh, it's right there. Found it. I think this is a totally different, like, area, though. I don't think this is actually the one that I'd already been in. Which is kind of hilarious. Yeah. New one. Well, okay. That's fine. Not a huge deal. That I haven't unlocked just for this expansion? God, what the fuck? I must not spend much time here. <laughs> to the west. I'm going west. Kind of. Aha! Hello! I was talking about spaghetti for like 20 minutes on Friday. I really wanted like some really good spaghetti with like homemade meatballs, like so bad. And then we were talking about lasagna and I just wanted some like super cheesy lasagna. Oh, it sounded so good. The east! Alright, we're not going east. Sorry, I'll go over there later. to go up that way. Let's go this way. Give me carbs. Delicious carbs. The thing about 14 is the end of the game isn't really the end. True. Oh, ramen. I miss ramen. We went and picked up ramen um, like last week. It was honestly pretty good. We got it from a place, a different location of a chain that we'd bought some before. 
And uh, it was actually pretty good. Your spinning map confuses me. Oh, do you not like that I, uh, that I have my mini map move? You don't spend a lot of time you're just here to get the last area and then everything gets flushed out in the patches, yeah. Hi friends, how's it going? The bridge ahead has collapsed. I'm afraid we shan't be crossing there, but worry not, I know another way. See you the towering structure to the north. We should be able to cross there. But 15 years abandoned and already Charlie and has fallen into such disarray. Verily a city no more Verily a city is no more than its inhabitants. Alright. Oh, this bridge is collapsed. Maybe? I don't know if it is. Oh, it is, okay. To the north. All right, well, we're going that way. Any road, what's bonkin' friendos? Any road, what's bonkin' bro? Oh my God. Jesus Christ, you scared me. <laughs> Authentic Remister's ugly. We do, yeah, yeah. And that was the thing is that we'd gone to this uh, chain I guess not chain. There's more than one location. We went to a location in a different city, a different part of town. And we didn't really like it. So we ordered it again and we got some different stuff. And I actually really liked it this time. It wasn't nearly as spicy as I wanted, but I'm used to that. Here for a lot longer than I remembered at first. Oh, really? Dang. Northwest. Oh, there it is. Hello. What the heck is that? A tarantula hawk? Oh god no. Fuck that, dude. Don't wanna look at that. Yikes, let me up. Dude, that's a big ol' fuck no. They judge you on how much you've eaten. I don't think I've ever eaten ramen in person where the bowl wasn't like ridiculously way too large. It's chasing you? Don't say that, bunny. I don't wanna be chased right now. Southwest, okay. Literally the opposite direction, so I won't be going that way. Idleshire? Idleshire? Oh. Oh, oh, oh. I almost always get an extra noodle portion because I like the noodles so much. Oh, some old school music for us. Knowledge seeks no man. So says the motto of Charlian engraved upon yonder stone. The meaning is simple. It falls to us to seek enlightenment. During the sixth astral era, after the turn of the 13th century, men from the northern nation of Charlian journeyed across the seas to Eorzea in search of knowledge. Upon arriving at these shores, they established a camp for their scholarly endeavors. Over time, this camp grew into a settlement, and the settlement prospered, and so much so that it came to be counted amongst Eorzea's great city-states. Alas, those glory days are but a fading memory. With her keepers lost to her, Charlene has become an empty husk of her former self. Mm, push call. Uplander is mistaken. Charlene has new keepers, is on cusp of new age of glory. Uh-oh, who's here? I'm scared. Oh, it's those guys. Tee-hee. <laughs> Goblins, here to plunder the city. <gasps> Uplander is mistaken muchly. We are not thieves. This place is our home. Oh, goodness. Your home? When last I looked, it was mine and Alfino's. We were born here. So he must be older than 15. We're getting it, dudes. When Uplanders abandoned city, Uplanders gave up claim. Born here or no, Uplanders are trespassers. What? 
You were just being so nice. Oh shit. All right, wiggle butts. <laughs> My friends, please. We did not come to dispute your claim to this land. Our purpose here is peaceful. We desire but to cross the river. Be calm, I beg you, and let us speak like civiliz the civilized folk that we are. Surely we can come to a mutual understanding. He's like, I'll think about it. <sighs> if that is the truth, then Uplanders are welcome here. Come with Slowfix. Slowfix will show Uplanders settlement. All right, well, that was easy. Oh, cool, I'm still on my broom. All right, well, hello, y'all. Oh man, look at all the stuff in here. The cenotaph. Look at this, man. You guys are taking good care of the place, Ugh, aren't you? Look how cute. Well, this place is precious. Oh, look at that. I don't know how it would taste in Australia. Yeah, your taste buds are upside down. It'd probably be way different. <gasps> Poggies! Poggies. Wowie. Howdy, wow. Well. Thanks for the 16 months. Uh, the tier one sub. Welcome back to the conversation, Whoa. Well. well, were you still playing 14? I know you were for a bit, but I don't know how far you got or what you were doing. Uh, guys, there's some Aussie in chat for Whoa73, well, the one and only. <laughs> Hi, guys. Hi. Sucks that new players can never experience the areas growing. I'm sure I used to be a dump. Ooh. I did try finding it in Melbourne for authentic Japanese. Brunsville used to be a tiny hamlet. Oh, I guess when the game was like new, Revenant's Toll would have been small, and then as you like leveled up or like you did stuff with it, would it get bigger? That's kind of neat. I didn't even think about that. We're playing Geshen Impact. Is that game fun? Whoa, well, I've just seen, I was watching Versus play it and it kind of just seems like he was just trying to like get a waifu. Like, do you play that game or is it just a collect all the waifus game? I have confusion. It's interesting. I've seen some gameplay where people think that it's like, it looks like Breath of the Wild, but also kind of looks like Nier Automata. It's Breath of the Wild. It's awesome. It's Breath of, it is Breath of the Wild? Really? Breath of the Waifu. Uh, I think I remember that Rev Toll changed over time, but I personally missed that part. Hmm. It's extremely addictive, basically. I love Wipe Impact running right now, actually. Oh. Well. It's very Breath of the Wild. Interesting. So do you, like, get waifus and then they, like, fight for you? Or do you play as them? A lot of content for a free-to-play game. Well, that's neato. I mean, it's because you can, like, buy rolls, right? I think it's best if y'all don't tell her. Just let Tori keep spinning up theories. Wait, you can play as husbands, too? Are there cute boys in that game? <gasps> Damn it. Y'all ruined my fun. <laughs> you were too slow, Alex. I'm sorry. It's a party system. Oh, okay, all right. I literally had just seen pictures, and I hadn't even, like, looked... I've just seen stuff on Twitter. Ah! Oops, ah, it's okay. He's just being dramatic. All right. Um, here is the heart of the settlement. Name of Idleshire. Oh, who's this? What have we got here? Guests? Who are you? <laughs> Greetings to you. I'm Afino Leveleur, and, I, and may I introduce my companions, Tori Tox and Ishtola. We've journeyed far in search of a friend and seek to cross the river. 
but find in the main bridge collapse, you went looking for a detour, ended up stumbling into Slowfix and his crew. Is that right? That is the short of it, I. This place, Idleshire. I came expecting a ghost town. Suffice it to say, I am pleased to find it so alive. Well, with all them precious artifacts lying about, it was only a matter of time before treasure hunters like me moved in. But we weren't the first to arrive, neither. By then, Slowfix and his gobby friends were already settled. At first, gobbies and hunters disliked each other. But understanding came, then friendship. Now gobbies and hunters have joined hands to build great new nation. Alright. So that is what happens after we Charlene's departed. Oh, so you're locals. Um, no hard feelings, I hope. All these nice buildings, but no one to live in them. Felt like a waste, you know? We've been trying to put the place to rights, and things have been going well for the most part, but to think to all smooth sailing. Not to sound ungrateful, but the traps your people left lying about are a bloody nuisance, and there's Illu Illuminati harrying us day and night. Psh, Slowfix has bright idea! Uplandish desire mutual understanding, yes? Best way to understanding is helping one another. Help citizens of Idleshire, and Uplanders can be citizens too. Citizens are free to cross river. Well, I am not aware of, a, aware of a quicker way to reach our destination. Let us assist Slowfix and his people. Cool. Uh, none of these are for me, sadly. So, uh, you have a four-party, four-character party. Command and attacks. attack. Such pretty fun comments. I'm not sure how I feel about the gotcha system. If there's only weapons and stuff, I'd be fine, but characters have a larger pack in the game. Mm. Hmm. Well, interesting. I don't know if it's a game that I would play, but it, like, everyone's, like, obsessed with it, so it's interesting. Just as, like, its existence. Plus. Oh, I get a- oh, these aren't books. Oh my god. Is that a shield? It's a shield! Oh man. Alright then. Knives. Oh, yes. I will stab you all. Okay, sorry. Except. So, Uplanders agreed to help. Good. Here's what Slowfix wants Uplanders to do. Many goblins, go golems prowl Idleshire, get in way of expansion plans. Slowfix wants Uplanders to eliminate goblet golems. Uplanders are Charlian, yes. Charlian should know best way to deal with creatures. Am I a Charlian? Goblins are strangely endearing. I think it's why they speak... I know, I'm saying they are. I was a rhetorical question, sorry. I was being, was being an idiot on purpose. The next part of that meme was, I know they are. I think that's they speak. They kind of talk like uh, if Darth Vader and uh, like someone from, oh yeah, I was gonna say Jar Jar. It's like Darth Vader and Jar Jar had a baby. Goblins? Yeah. They talk like Darth Vader and goblins, or Jar Jar Binks had a baby. I was gonna say the Muppets, but Jar Jar Binks is much more accurate. So, we are to eliminate the golems. That should be a simple enough affair. The automata were employed as sentinels, and by design can be unmade with a coded command. At the time of the exodus, it was knots and crosses, and I see no reason why it uh, should not still work. Let us divide the task between the three of us. The quicker to be finished with it. Uh, with the chat mode in say, use your keyboard or the software keyboard to enter the code command knots and crosses to unmake a golem. How do I do that? Say. Wow. Wow, we Neato. Alright, cool. What was it? Knots and something? Knots and crosses. Alright. It's on the screen. Don't worry. I got it. We got there. Oh, hello. There's no attack. Okay, he's not going to attack. Rumble, rumble. <laughs> Alright. Listen here, bud. Uh, knots and then crosses. Did it work? Don't worry about it. Do I put slash?
<laughs> no, I just have to fucking capitalize it all. With a shudder, the golem crumbles to pieces. Wow, good job, bud. Up! Oh! Gonna go touch the butt! Do boo do 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 do. Do ba be do be do ba 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 da wa. Knots and crosses. <laughs> All right. It's over here. On an adventure. Hello. Ah, uh, yes. Got pumpkins. What is this? Oh, it's like a scarecrow. He's got like two swords. That's really funny. Ooh, look at this. Wasn't that fun? What's in here? I can't go that way. All right, fine. This part of this song is very Zelda. Very like Ocarina of Timey. <laughs> All right. What's up, losers? I'm back. Golems are no more. Wonderful. There you go, Kamiko. Now we can resume work to expand settlement. None of these things are for me. <gasps> A book? Book? Is it better? It's better! It is so much better than my book, actually. Wow, okay. Except. Fishka, Uplanders helped Gobby Flock, earned right to be citizens of Idleshire. Uh, but Slovis must ask another favor. Another, another favor, you say? Short time ago, dear friend of Slowfix, uh, ventured into Illuminati territory. Illuminati are nasty goblins, no mercy even towards Gobblekin. Huh. Slowfix fears for a friend's life. Please find friend before Illuminati do. I'm suddenly taken by a sense of foreboding. Be that as it may, we cannot turn a blind eye. Let us make haste to find Slowfix's friend. Well, maybe. Maybe not. Try reading Gobi speak. Yo, sometimes you just gotta be a Gobi, alright? Sometimes. Gotta be a Gobi. Where are we going? <laughs> oh. Where am I? I'm there. Oh, I have to leave the area. Alright, that's fine. Have I- where is even this? Oh, I see, I see, I see. Gobby mind fruit trees plucked to bare bottoms. Oh my god, Moogle! Oh my god, double Moogles. There's a Moogle and a Lala Moogle. Oh, he's oh, just- he's as tall as my minion! I just haven't left yet. I entered, like... No, I really wasn't gonna. Double Moogles all the way across the sky! You crafting, ma'am? Doing a good job. Wait, oh, I went the wrong way. I need to go over there. Oops. I'm paying attention. I find it very funny that the, uh,. The uh, Lollafells are almost the same height as uh, as the minions. The broom! We're taking the broom, Kamiko, don't worry. Oh, there's two ways to go. It's probably not the way I- yeah, we'll figure it out. 
Be the final boss that is Phoenix registration. I'm installing. Hey! Congratulations, Shasenka. We're gonna get addicted. Welcome to the club. All right. Do you child with as, as much purpose as the law fellows do? You know what? No. No, they do not. Sadly. I guess I already looked over there. Shasenka's ready to join... Ready to join the masses. Don't look at me. Ooh, they make horrible noises, don't they? With 4,000 hours in WoW over the last four years. All right, Shashanka. So here's the deal. You can get a little addicted. What? But I am not responsible. I'm not responsible. I claim nothing. What does this person have? Hello? Hello? Ooh, something soon. I'm gonna blame some other people. It's fine. Okay, good, good, good. Too far away. I'm literally right next to it. Nothing. You look like this might be an ether current thing. You wanna help me out, bud? It is! You are stranger! You are sneaky peeker! You are thief working for Illuminati! You can't take these things! No, no, no! They are for all to enjoy! But Illuminati always try to steal and hide things! Tap clicks must be on constant guard! If you say you are Gobby friend, then prove it! Find Illuminati and defeat them! Drive them away from this place! Alright, don't worry, I got you, bud. I'm here to help. Don't worry! I'm here to help. Oh, can't go that way. Alright, good to know. The good idea is why I had the ideas but ditched. Have I found the hard and extreme dungeons yet? Uh, I've only done the dungeons needed to, like, complete the story. So, I did the ones that I had to do in order to, like, uh, progress to the next part of the story, but that's it. You guys shooting at me? That's fucking rude. Wow, congratulations, you've been defeated. Uh, you didn't think I'd be a little taller. <laughs> you know, just a bit. Wait, do I have to keep going? Oh, I have to keep going, no. Okay. I thought I was done, I'm not done. There's more to beat up. Cause you know mounts. Oh yeah, no, I don't have most of the like, I haven't done anything to like, uh, farm like mounts or anything. I've just been riding my witch's broom around because it makes me happy. Ryuji, help me. Okay. Why is that like that? Ruin four. Help me. Oh, I see. It's because I, I procced it. Got it. Lustus! Howdy doody, dude. Happy Saturday. How are you today? I'm happy to see you, friend. I forget there if they're required. I had to go back and do all of the like trials with the primals on like hard mode. <gasps> you slew Illuminati fighty force. You are a true copy friend. There are uh, the things here are for all people of Idleshire, but Illuminati tried to steal them away. Illuminati is our enemy. Illuminati is your enemy. This means you are our friend. Thanks, friend. For well, the ether current. <laughs> Was Leviathan required? Hard Leviathan? No, I don't think so. I only did Leviathan once. Was playing Among Us with Tilly and friends. <gasps> oh my gosh. Is Tilly a good liar? Tell me. Tell me right now. Tell me to my face. Is Tilly a good liar or not? Nah? 
I feel like she's either would be super good at lying and like would be a master imposter or she would giggle too much. There would be no in between. Yes? Oh my gosh. The enemy of our enemy is not our enemy. Mm, precisely. What? I mean, I don't know. Even before that, it's not like there was a lot of uh, stuff going on between there. Sorry. We still have that world security. I wonder what happened to it. I stole it. I'm just kidding. <laughs> I didn't steal it. This one's mine. Oh, I gotta fight people. Okay. An Illuminati instant. You're above the max level. Yeah, it'll be fine. It'll be fine. Find a fire Francis goes. There you go. It'll happen. I did have this kind of lost for a while because it was summer. So I had, I like found it again and I gave it a good old wash so I could wear it. It's just so giant and comfy and warm that I wear it a lot like in the house and I wore it to work a bunch last like winter. <gasps> Goodly Uplander, long time no eye catch. What is bringing Uplander here? <gasps> Does Uplander have lusty, eye lusty eyes for a junk of Brayflox? Uplander must not be touching junk of Brayflox. Brayflox is finding junk first. I knew I recognized that voice. Greeting, Brave Flocks. It has been a while. Forgive us for interrupting your work, but Captain Weiskit gave me to understand that you are marked by the Illuminati. This happens to be Illuminati-held territory. Is it wise to be here? Pshaw! Brave Flocks eat Illuminati for sunupsies. <laughs> for breakfast. All right. All right. Listen here, you little cutie talk. Oh! Oh, they bad. Oh, they naughty. Oh, no. Who eats for who? Who eats who for sunupsies? Ooh ah! <laughs> Brave flocks all talks. Unwise you are to come here after dirty talking secret knowings of a cheese make from Illuminati. Brave flocks did no unright. Cheese recipe is gobby birthright. Are they arguing about an actual recipe for cheese? <gasps> Save ton flocks for trading in death pit. <laughs> oh, why do they have a giant mechanical tank? Okay, then. My hoodie's in the wash now. I can't wait to get comfy. Oh, I'm so happy that I can wear, like, sweaters and hoodies and stuff. Well, kind of. It's still, like, 80 at the end of the day here in Texas, but... Pray to Godfathers, for punishment is near times! It appears we have no choice. She stole their cheese recipe? That is so funny. I guess I remember running into that one. To that, into that, like, goblin. Maybe I remember stuff about cheese. I don't know.
good. Wait, wait, wait. That's not good. I don't like that. What are you doing over here? Why is that gold? That's weird. What is that? How long have I stand here? Nothing? Okay. Ishtola? Oh, is that Ishtola? That's some Ishtola bullshit. Isha, okay. To me. Alright, Ishtola. You do you, boo. You. How about you? Ishtola! Damn, girl, what the fuck? Alright, ma'am. Holy shit. Dude, he's told us not playing around anymore. God damn, girl. Holy crap. All right. Oh, there's more. Of course there's more. He's definitely, uh, kind of needs some healing, though. You could go for that, ma'am. Look! Tola. Oh my goodness. Yeah, run away, you nerd. Illuminati, no match for furious gob fix of Bray Flox. Yeah, you did a lot, Bray Baby. You did great. More junk is awaiting Bray Fox Muchly. Bray Fox is taking leave of Uplanders. Ma'am, you cannot just... Okay. <laughs> Oh no. Still is very anime. Honestly, yes. This one is particularly like that. Particularly like that. Being embroiled in a cheese war was the last thing I expected coming to Charlian. At any rate, we fulfilled Slowfix's request. Let's return uh, with good tidings and be on our way. Okay. Oh, look, there's another one of me. Well, not me, but another one of my. Adventuring types. Is over a hundred in LA today? I Warder said. I think it was Warder. Someone said that earlier today. Can we go? And I'm so sorry. That's way too hot for October. Like that's insane. <laughs> uh. Hmm. All right. Ha cha. Uplanders are back. Did Uplanders find friend of Slowfix? We did. <gasps> Time has not cured recklessness. Recklessness of Brayflox. Without help from Uplanders, Brayflox would now be dead. Gobby. Slowfix owes Uplanders debt of gratitude. Slowfix and Brayflox are joined by unseverable Gobby Bond. If Slowfix had known that Uplanders are friend of Brayflox, Slowfix would have welcomed Uplanders to Gobby Flock at first meeting. Cool, thanks. Should a name draft? Oh, yeah. Oh, I have something else, too. Oh, I got a new... Bracelets? Oh, I got new pants, and they look ugly. Wait, did I get a new book or not? Yeah, I did. This is the new book. Guys, they changed my pants and I look silly now. Why did my pants change? When did I get new pants? I don't remember getting new pants. Literally never. Oh, probably a nice tune. Oh, I don't know that. 
Star plate time. JK. Maybe soon. Maybe soon. Oh, we're leaving. Oh, book. Book. This is for a scholar, though, not a summoner. Not that it super matters. In the last one. Yeah, that's what Alex was saying, is that I got it from the dungeon. I just didn't know. A grateful soul fix is ready to grant you at your heart's desire. Oh, grant you your heart's desire, which is leaving. Sorry. Oh, Uplanders have upheld bargain most highly. As promised, Slowfix makes Uplanders honored citizens of Idleshire. Free to cross river at will. Though Uplanders must leave for now, Slowfix hopes that Uplanders will pay many visits and help build great new nation. You are most kind, my friend. You may be certain that we will return. I must confess, at first it upset me to learn that my home had been occupied by others, but I see now that it is in good hands. Under your care, I look forward to seeing Charlie and Thrive once more, uh, to become a home to people of all races and creeds. Slowfix has already ordered the Gobwatch to let up Landers through. Safe travels! Alphano, Tori, shall we then? Let's go! All right. What is this? You got an ether current for me, bud? Hey, he does. Ooh, what are these? Oh, arm guards. Oh. It's okay. Except. Oh, half six has a very important task for a trusty uplander. Must be done with fatness. Uh, etherite uh, of Idleshire needs inspection. Maybe needs upkeep, too. Uh, if gobbies do not take a look and fix little problems, its spinnings may shudder and stop. Or there is a very big boom, but Half Six does not have the right tools. Uplander, there is no time to waste. Half Six needs ether flow distributors. Uh, the nearest are in the base of the Illuminati. Come, come, raid their store pots. Oh. <laughs> All right. <laughs> hey, will you go steal some of this? Thanks. We are that lore guy is also the translation lead. Wait, really? Oh, that's fun to know. Also very helpful. I guess it helps them make a lot of it make sense. Oh, hey, Gobswat. Wait, no. I don't go that way. I'm gonna go there. You can go here. All right. I'm trying to get this etherite current. It's probably gonna be the last thing I do tonight, but I'm gonna go get it. Do, do, do. Interesting story how I got that job. This is pretty funny. Will you zoom out? I can only zoom out that far. Wait, where the hell am I going? Oh no, leave me alone. I wasn't paying attention. I wasn't paying attention, leave me alone. Oh, is it there? Is it there. He also does the vocals for the Moogle Mog Fight song. Wait, really? That song was a bop. I uh, I approve greatly. He sings with the primals at performances too. So he's literally, literally a jack of all trades. But he was like, here's stuff I like. I'm going to do all of it. Ooh, that's, that's death. Don't go that way. Well, not death because I can't fall, but. Oh, I think I see it. It's right there. Okay, I just hadn't zoomed in enough. Well, now we know. Pretty much. I mean, honestly, if it's something if it's something that he likes and he has the ability and, like, the skills to do more than one part of it, like, that's actually pretty cool. Oh, my. Oh, that's a, that's a mount. I was like, what the fuck is that? <laughs> wow. Like Sokken and then this geeky-looking white guy singing. Aww. Listen. Love it. Sign me up. Do I have a thing for geeky looking white guys? Yes. <laughs> Alex from this other room. Hey. <laughs> hello, hello. Yes, I'm here. To uh, raid your stores and whatnot. Goblin sharpshooter. Don't see me. All right, thanks. Oink. 
get in here? Is there a door? I suppose so. Fate discovered nearby. Wow. Don't my How do I get- Oh, no. Well, there has to be a door somewhere. I think he's in the pickup devs where getting the guys in a line reacting meme. Goodness. Ow. Aha, doors. Wait, no, this is where this person was. Let me in. Let me in. There's stairs? Lights are on, someone's home. Yoshi P him and Sokken. I can hear things in there. Oh, I see light. Yes, I have found, nope, nope, just a window. All right. What the fuck? Ugh. Do I have to use my brain for this? Just let me walk in. Hmm. Can I jump up here? I don't, I'm too short. What's up y'all? How's it going? Nani the fuck? How the hell do I get in there? A doo doo. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nope. Is that go? Oh! Y'all. Can I- will you get off of your fucking mouth? There's another one that's just like right next to us that just doesn't care- Oh, now they're both near me. Alright, that's fine. I should have called my chocobo. I might die. These guys kind of hurt. Is one of you up there hitting me as well? Because that's some bullshit. It's 14 right now. I've got to get ready for the next expansion. When is that actually supposed to come out, though? It's going to be a while, isn't it? The two expansions lost close to each other. Would that happen? Would that be a thing that would happen? I don't actually know. Next summer should lunch. Oh, that's a while. Why don't I thought? How come I can't enter? Let me in. Let me in! It won't let me in. I went around the both sides and I didn't see it. I literally have circled around it twice. No, I want to look it up. And turn it around. No, I went around in a circle. Like that's the thing is I went around in an actual literal circle. And da 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 da. Or do you yourself turn around? No. Is this a video? How do I? Oh my god, let me skip. What a weird, what a weird thing. Fighting this thing. 
Oh, they're already inside. Wow, not helpful. Hey, Freakish. What's up today, dude? It doesn't even actually show him going into it. Yikes. Uh. I walked the whole way. Do, do, do. Don't see me. I'm very small. You cannot see. Don't attack you. No one sees me. Ha ha. Sneaky. Can't see me. Can't see me. Can't see me. Ha ha. Cannot see me. Please you be able to up. Yeah, okay, you can see me. I'm leaving. Goodbye. Being sick earlier this week. 80s and Star Wars. Playing two games at once? Wow. Who are you? Yeah, just. Attacking me, Free. You're doing great. Don't see me. Don't see me. Don't see me. All oh, my eyeballs hurt, y'all. I need to stop staring at a screen. Mm -hmm. Oh! Okay, I don't think I can run past that guy. But I want my chocobo out. Ryuji! An ether current here too. No, that's what I'm doing. So this is a quest to get an ether current, which is why I went to go do it. Ooh! I want to touch this. Probably can't touch this, but I want to touch it. I know you can't touch it. Man. Oh. Oh! Look at that. Oh shit. Can't see me. Ha ha. I switch your games on the daily, as far as my ego goes. That's not a bad thing, though. It's kind of neat that you can switch between them, by the way. That way you don't get, like, bored of the current game you're playing. Oh, my eyeballs hurt! Alright, we're fine. Where are the sparklies? Ah. Don't mind me, just stealing your pottery. We do I need three? <coughs> Excuse me! you tiny demon. Ah, he can't see me. Back to here. Yes. Let's go. Teleporting. Did you start with level 50 or 60? I started at level one. No, I started at level one. I was a bab. A wee bab. Oh, a wee bab whose eyeballs hurt. God, my eyes hurt. Ooh, do you have an ether current too, friend? No, he's got wondrous tails. What's that? And it makes you feel not entirely comfortable. What is that though? Talks? Tori talks? Gods, is it really you? I've heard the songs and tales, but to think the day would come that I'd meet you in the flesh. Whatever have I done to deserve such an honor? Drat, of all the days to forget to polish my armor. She must think I'm a total bumpkin. But wait, dare I ask? No, I daren't to impose on such a hero. Oh, but what is the harm in trying? Yes, I must try. <gasps> you see, I'm in a bit of a bind. A pickle, if you will. Uh, I've just taken on the task of sorts, a task far, far beyond the abilities of a two-gill greenhorn like myself. Oh my god. <laughs> it's a weekly mission thing? Oh, interesting. But you, yes, a realm-renowned hero like you could tackle this monumental task in your sleep, blindfolded and with both arms and leg tied behind your back. So you'll do it for me, yes? Wonderful. Just head over to Rowena's and tell Kolipoli you're here to help. Did, did I say Kolipoli? Oh, I meant Koi, Chloe Alep. 
Ho-ho. Uh, that is my silly little name for her, and I certainly haven't been frequenting her shop every day for the past two moons. That her ever so cute little smile might brighten my dark and dreary days. Ugh, but I've blabbered on enough, haven't I? Ta-ta! Alright, I don't think I'm actually gonna do that. That's okay, though. It's, what do you get for it? <laughs> I'm confused. Didn't know you could pay to skip parts of the game until a couple months ago. I would have been upset if I had skipped parts of the games. So I'm happy that I played it all the way through. They did, like, update it a lot, which is why I played it now. And why a bunch of people started new characters now. Or started playing at all now. Uh, I did find your ether distributors. Here you go, friend. I only got a little lost. Thank you, Uplander. With these, half six can do upkeep. Uplanders of Charlien are making etherites to whirl using tricksy ancient knowings. If Gobby Flock uses tools and parts left by old Uplanders, an etherite of Idleshire will stay spinning for many, many years. Thanks, bud. Thanks a lot. Meow. Would be weird to me. Yeah, and I'm sure, like, if all you like is, like, like, you don't like the story, you just want to do dungeons and stuff, like, I guess. I guess. Mm -hmm. That I guess meme? Just, I guess. Oh, God, zoom out. All right. Oh, is that up here? Uh... All right. Time to Skyrim it. But I felt. I didn't actually mean to talk to this person, but I'll just go do it then. Oh, look how tiny she is! Hi there, lady. I'm Chloe. Chloe Alipo. And who might you be? I'm Tori. Hi. Tori Talks, THE Tori Talks from all the stories. Wow, you're like a legend, a real living, breathing legend. This is so exciting. Did I tell you I love stories? Well, I do, and not just listening to them. Uh, I'm pretty good at telling them too. I have this friend whose mommy and daddy went away and never came back, and well, she gets lonely and cries sometimes, so I tell her stories to cheer her up. Oh, look, she has stuffed all those guys. All right, that's right, stories of brave adventurers like you. She likes my stories. She stops crying and even starts smiling and laughing. Seeing her happy makes me happy too. But lately, she's been staring off in space again. Uh, it must be my fault. I bet all my stories are starting to sound the same. But then I had an idea. Do you know what it is? I'll ask great adventurers like you to tell me your stories and then I'll put them together to make new stories of my own. It's a really great idea, right? Tell me you think so too. So will you help me? Rowena gives me all sorts of things when I work hard. So if you do this for me, I can give some of them to you. What sort of things? Well, tone stones for one, and well, all kinds of other special stuff. But not my Mandrangora pin. That's all mine. So do me a favor. Remember all your bestest stories and write them in this notebook here. I call it Chloe's Wondrous Tales because I have a tale and I tell tales. Get it? Yes, I get it, small child. <laughs> Every time your stories uh, help me come up with a new tale of my own. I'll give you a present. It'll be a lot of fun for both of us, don't you think? Thanks, Tori. And by the way, you're even cuter than I pictured you from the stories. Tee hee. All right. Cool. Scary eyes. You think she's scary? Wondrous Tales Unlocked. Welcome to Wondrous Tales. Henceforth, you can show your tales of heroism and daring do for the chance to earn valuable rewards. Again, you want to obtain a Wondrous Tales journal from Chloe. In addition to the one you've just received, a new journal will be available every week. Oh. Within a journal card is 16 squares, four columns of four rows, each representing a certain quest of duty or a category of the same. Triumph in the corresponding adventure, so when marked off, you can mark up a square on a single card. Wait the described then, for example, marking off nine squares, marking off four squares in a row. Oh, it's like bingo. Uh, that's neat though. 3 a.m. Earth, I like that they specify Earth time. Oh my God. <laughs> well, that was... Uh, that was a thing that I just did. Alright, fam. I'm gonna go stand sort of close to where the next part of my adventure is gonna take me. As I prepare... Uh, to end stream for tonight. I had a lot of fun playing Final Fantasy today. But I am tired and my butt hurts. So, you know, sometimes you gotta do what you gotta do. A lot of progress. We did do a lot tonight, actually. We got really far. Perfect timing. Hi, Kiwi. Did you just get back? <laughs> Are you going to bed? 
Uh, bye, bye, Jones. Bye, everybody. Uh, thank you, new friends. We had a bunch of new followers today. Welcome, friends. I'm really glad that you're here. Make sure if you haven't already, do follow me here on Twitch so that way you can hang out with us when I stream some more. I'll be back tomorrow. <gasps> Jones, thanks for the host. Wow. Wow. Thanks, Jones. Good night. Good night, Mizzino. Good night, everybody. Thank you for stream. Thank you for stream. Thank you all, y'all. Thanks for being here. I had a lot of fun tonight. There's a lot of stuff happening. Uh, but make sure you follow me here on Twitch. Uh, I'll be live again tomorrow afternoon around 4 p.m. Central America time. Thank you for stream, Tori. Thank you for existing, Fallen. Have a good night, friend. Thanks, Tori. Take care. Uh, well, huh? Adieu. Haha. <laughs> See you later, Mr. Fix It. Thanks, EU Friendly Weekend Stream. Yeah, I, I attempt. I do know that 4 p.m. is still pretty late if you're a, a European viewer, but we try. We try. Uh, but yeah, you guys are cool. Thanks for being here. Make sure you follow me on Twitter. I also have an Instagram if you want to check out there. I mostly just post on my stories, but it's fun. Uh, we will be moving soon, so if you guys uh, will just be kind and understanding as my schedule's a little wibbly-wobbly, timey-wimey, fucky-wucky as we say. Uh, but yeah. Just got some life stuff to take care of, like moving and having a full-time job. And yikes, imagine, imagine. Imagine. So let's, moving to North Pole. I am, I'm gonna go be an elf. Uh, I'm tired of working on controllers. I wanna work for Santa. He seems like a good guy, you know. Just kidding. All right, let's see. It is a Saturday night on twitch.tv. If you guys want to stick around uh, and join us for a raid slash hose, let's go see who's live right now. Sharktooth is live. Oh my God, on his own channel even. Ha <laughs> ha. Having a full-time job, can't imagine. Not in these times. No cap, no cap. Zero cap. Listen, am I thankful that I am employed? Yes. Am I tired? Also, yes. Ah. <laughs> uh, have a good one. Have a good one, everybody. I'm gonna read my friend Shark. He um, is playing some Among Us, but he also seriously loves WoW. Uh, he's pretty funny. He's entertaining. He's sus as fuck, though, so we are going to do this. If you don't mind, listen. If you don't like Curse, you don't have to. Good night, Cry. Good night, Yukin. Uh, we're gonna do sus as fuck. Uh, go bother him. He seems to be seems to be a just a crewmate right now, but uh, go give him a hard time, guys. Thank you, Kim, for being here. Thanks for hanging out with me and being awesome. Thank you to Cohort for all those gifted subs. Uh, my little tree to heart is so thankful. Uh, thank you for the new subs, for the resubs. Thanks for being cool. Uh, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Have a good night. Bye.